Hello guys, happy Sunday. I have a live kitty here. I have a live one. Just can't see her because she's out of Oof. Hello. Oh he who is this one? Hi. <laughs> Hello guys. Okay, I think she also managed to put some music on. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you for the ooh, Anonymous. I hope you're having a lovely weekend. Hello, everyone. How's it going? Thank you for starting the music, uh, cat. That was Lumi. My more elusive kitty cat. <laughs> Hello. I hope you guys are doing well. Happy Sunday. Have you guys had a nice weekend? I realize it's been a long time since my last stream. I'm sorry that I canceled on you guys Wednesday. I was just so tired and I was like, I just need to need to have a chill week. Hopefully you guys have been good since I last saw you. Anyone up, been up to anything funsies? Hello, Nils. Hi, short round. I don't want me to, to remind you about the sword mogs because the traveler's log is ending in one week. My job is done. <laughs> I actually completely forgot about that. I don't think I have those sword mogs. I can't believe we're already at the end of April. Next week is the end. Oh my god, next week is the last week of April. Stuff is going so fast. Holy crap, Marinos. I will have to I will have to get my butt back onto World of Warcraft to to fix that. Thank you for the reminder. <laughs> Hello, Sleepy. Welcome back. Hi, Michael. <laughs> Yo, what's up, B? When Guild Wars turns into to, to character you mean cat stream? I can't everyone comes for the kitty cats. <laughs> Hello. Uh, is it dreamt or doctor? Empt. No, <laughs> I don't know. Welcome. I hope you like my kitty cats. Hello, Diesel. Good to see you again. What's up? Hello, Krume. How are you? <laughs> Thank you. Hello, Kaladzax. What's up? All right. I don't think my cat drank with this. Why is that so low? Fuck you too, Sleepy. <laughs> my duck my duck sounds just It's just botched. I don't know why. Where is Yeti? <laughs> I have no idea where Alpha is at the moment. Um but oh my goodness! Mouser's gifted a tier three sub to call on tax. They have given 30 gift subs in the channel. Nails. Oh my goodness, thank you for gifting a tier 3 sub to Cal. Oh my goodness. Now go forth and spread the stabby emote. <laughs> thank you so much, Nils. Hello, Naz. Welcome back. What's up? Oh my god, what's with all of these butt emotes in chat? <laughs> How's Naz doing today? Okay, do you know what? Nils, you just took my last kitty post-it. This is the last this is the last cute sticky I have, and then I gotta go get like normal stickies or something. And I need to order new cute stickies for next month for May. I need to not forget about that. Mm. I believe we should use all of Nils' names on the board. Nils has always been Nils here. Well, okay, sometimes sometimes it was God of Boobs, I guess. And sometimes it was Nils. Gotta pay them taxes, thank you. Lumi appreciates that. Lulu. He's he's behind my monitor. We said hello at the beginning of stream, but no, now she wants to play with my curtain. Ah, oh well. He's cats, man. Can't control him. Can't control him. 
but I convert cat tags into cat pats. So uh, the cats say thank you. <laughs> okay, so why is why is uh, why is Diesel very nervous today? What's up with that? It's Sunday. Nice chill day. Why are we nervous? <gasps> you want to boop? Boop. Huh? Want to boop? She's like, I'm really sleepy, but I want to boop. But no, she decided to close her eyes. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, you have a first date later on. <gasps> Where are you going? What are you doing? What are the plans? How are you going to bedazzle your day? <laughs> Nils, thank you so much for the tier three. Thank you. All right. Now our wall is filled with so many cute stickies. I need to get more cute ones. More cool ones. I need to remember to do that. Oh my god, you're gonna go do an escape room? That is so boss. Especially, <laughs> especially as a first date. I love that. I would never, I would never have thought of something like that anyway. Is it, is it a scary one? Or, or maybe you call those panic rooms. You for sure. Well, that's going to be interesting. It's not a scary one. <laughs> you, you just imagine. <laughs> you just imagine. <laughs> imagine being in a really scary one. <laughs> you guys like screaming at each other like super, super, uh, super scared and trying to get out. Hey, but the good thing about, uh, the good thing about doing an escape room with, with, you know, as a first date is at least you will kind of figure out right away if you're compatible or not, I suppose. You know, like you're both under pressure. Will you work well together? Or will you just scream at each other and be like, no, you're wrong? <laughs> I think it's quite creative. I like it. Stuck in a room with a person you hardly know. <laughs> Nothing could go wrong. <laughs> well, I mean, there's a potential for some chaos, maybe, but... I think it'll be fine. Bam this <laughs> That is incredibly adorable and also very uh very sus. <laughs> Hello, madam. Hi guest. How are you guys doing? Hello, Yin. Thank you. <laughs> How is everyone? How has your week been since I last saw you? I obviously still haven't changed my arena net password yet, so you know I have to go the roundabout way to <clears throat> get that. So bad. What would Val do as a first date? That's a good question. I I was never really a like a dating person in that way, or you know when I was very boring. I'm Gen C and the weird ways to go with dates. What's up with grabbing a coffee? Is it too normal? <laughs> I mean, I guess, like, the, the one time, like, I did date, it was just like going out for dinner. Like, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> that's, a, that's a boring answer, but that's true. Um, yeah, basically, just dinner. Or like when you were in high school, it was like, go to the cinemas. Oh, that was a long time ago. I hope you're doing, <laughs> I hope you're doing well, by the way, Oliver. Good to see you again. Welcome back. Uh, I got asked a question earlier. What I wish, I wish I was asked more often. What, and what, what question was that, Nils? The ultimate Swedish compatible, <laughs> compatible test was me. Can you build IKEA furniture without killing each other? <laughs> I can tell you what, mom and I can't do it. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> mom and I get so frustrated at each other. Like it will work, it will work good for a while, and then all of a sudden we fast forward like 
to we'd be building ikea furniture for like eight hours and none of us has eaten anything and we get like hangry and grumpy with each other <laughs> but you usually usually it works out in the end somehow <clears throat> Ikea is just a bigger set of Legos. Yeah, but Legos is a little bit easier, wouldn't you say? 27 months. Holy gingerly. <laughs> Hello, Mickey! <laughs> Thank you for the 27 months, dude. What's up? How are you? Oh my god. Mickey, I don't have any cute stickies left. An ordinary square sticker for a not ordinary man. How about that? <laughs> that is, uh, that is a lot of months. Thank you, <laughs> thank you, Mickey. Uh, Mickey, where would you go for a first date? gingerly she said gingerly because you put shit in the tts the tts lady doesn't like bad words that's why <laughs> i'm not very outgoing so dates would be rough for me hey well you can like start slow you start baby steps you just do most of the interaction online and then like just you could always do something easy which is like i mean the easy ones like go to the movies because then you only have to talk to them like before and after and you don't have to worry about like talking during the movie and then you got something to talk about as well because you can talk about the movie after you can technically also talk about the movie before if you're like, excited about it did you say a lot of months <laughs> well are one loops yeah no. thank you for the 28 months <laughs> that is a lot of months thank you like I said, I'm out of the cute stickies, so we're doing backup stickies for now. Thank you for all the help and support. Oh, Mickey! Okay, Mickey, bedroom. That's for me and today at our first date. Mickey, bedroom. Ugh. We're trying to be creative here. <laughs> we're trying to be creative here. Going to the movies is one of the worst date things one can do. Uh, if you're an extrovert, yeah. But if you're an introvert, no. I don't think so. It gives you... It does. It puts... It takes pressure off you. It's, uh, it's less interaction. And you have something... You have something to talk about. I took stays to the movies last night. Oh, you, you said... You've seen John Wick 4. Was it good? I need to re- I want to re-watch the other John Wick movies. And then go see number 4. I haven't done that yet. Sleepy, you love building Ikea furniture? Okay. I love the idea of going to Ikea and picking out the stuff I want. And then I don't like actually building it. It's satisfying when it's done. And you built it correctly and it's stable. <laughs> But I don't like building it. It's boring. It takes such a long time, especially if you buy like a bunch of things. Hmm. Nils, I don't even know who Monkey D. Luffy is. Is this like a One Piece question or something? John Wick was really good. John Wick 4 is nice. I love stupid action flicks. I was like, it's a well-made action flick. You know? You always mess something up when building Ikea furniture. Yes, definitely. But I also feel like I've built so much Ikea furniture in my life now. That at least I don't mess up. That much anymore. <laughs> I mean, I, I've... Especially when I tend to buy like the same, um, like what do you call it? Like the same series. I already know how it's built. Like I've built it before. I have definitely put stuff on like back to front and then noticed like too far down the road. And you're just like, no, like you have to undo so much to like reverse back to the point. 
that you messed up. Darn it. I still haven't gotten a single IKEA cabinet to light up properly. I hate that. When you get multiple ones like the same. Like I have three cabinets that are stacked against the wall on top of each other. It took a lot of adjusting to get the doors to all like line up on their hinges. <laughs> but when your whole house is just IKEA furniture, you kinda learn. Okay, Yoon can apparently wait till next month for his sticky. Mickey, I know you're an impatient fuck. Go to a medieval market for your first date. How cozy. How cozy. Mickey, feel special. You absolute git. I know you like feeling special. You are not special. Val, what are you going to get co-op with Kim Morris and join our raid team? Okay, so I am like halfway through Living World Season 2. Okay, I'm so close. People are telling me that what I have left in Season 2 is like quite short. Uh, or quicker compared to the other stuff that I've been doing previously. So I should be ready for Heart of Thorns soon. Soon. Have you done all of the story, Mickey? Have you done every single living world and every single expansion story up to End of Dragons? I don't know if I would say season two is short than in total, but <laughs> I I have done half of season two anyway. Yoo-hoo! Hello, Sam. How are you doing today? Best way to go on a date? To see how she dresses. To go... What? If it's fancy, go... Oh. Oh, you wait to see how she's dressed. If it's fancy, go for a nice dinner. If it's kind of deeds and such, go for a walk, mini golf, anything sporty, or the movies. Sorry for the paragraph. I want you to be sorry for the paragraph. That's kind of smart. You're thinking, you're thinking of like seeing what kind of vibe she's going for. But you could also, you could also ask her if she wants to do something like more casual or more fancy as well. Hello, KJ. Welcome back. What's up? But, um, I don't know. I, I guess I kind of like mixing it up because like, it's nice. It's nice to to do different things. I mean, I like fancy dinners and I like mini golf. <laughs> Nils, you did some of the story Guild Wars two today. Well done. What story have you done, Tyler? What what part of the story have you done up to? Mickey was done with the story in Guild Wars two like a month ago. Which oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, I'm such a pleb, and I'm so slow at this game. <laughs> you've always done 100% of every map, and you're doing Season of Dragon achievements. I think I have 35% map completion, but I know that's just, like, the base map. Uh, but I think it's it's a good work in progress, to be honest. Every time I ask, I never got a straight answer. <laughs> Just be like, yo, lady, you want to go fancy or you want to go fun? Can't do both at the same time. Okay, you, you can, but. <laughs> Hello, Kuo. Happy Sunday. How are you? Okay, so how fast do I get another amount once I've entered Heart of Thorns? Or is it, is it. No, it's my glider. I get a glider. I don't get a mount. Or or get and get. They don't just spoon feed you. But that you're able to unlock. It's just the glider thing, right? Yeah, I get the glider. And then the bunny is Path of Fire, right? The other mounts. Or... <laughs> Not everyone thinks that golfing is fun, guess. <laughs> okay, maybe. 
<laughs> Hello, Tanley. Welcome back. Yo, long time no see. How you doing? Akuo, tell us, what's your new main in World of Warcraft gonna be? I know, I know you've been having problems trying to find something. Slider first, then the rest of the Path of Fire map. Oh my god. It's gonna take my ages to get something new and fancy. Yeah, fine. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna get my bunny eventually. And then I'll have two bunny mounts. Then I'll have Mr. Bunny and what do I what do I what do I call my bunny mount? What do I actually call the Springer? Bumper? <laughs> or Stumpy? Or Bigfoot? <laughs> uh painful first date whoa were well, you trying to send her home with bruises sam <laughs> horseback riding would be awesome but i feel like that's something that's not really common i guess i mean it depends on where you live obviously i know you you are you're like surrounded by horses guests and then people that you know uh like horses in the city, it's not super common to be like, yo, let's go for a horse ride. I wish it was. It's super cozy. It is super, super cozy. My goodness. I hear Guild Wars music in the background. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's pause that. Listen to the, the sounds of the game. Uh oh, I clicked stuff I wasn't supposed to click. First date idea, go parachuting. Oh my god, Oliver, what the heck? <laughs> I love it. I've always wanted to go parachuting. I'm just chicken. I'm not like, I don't really have a fear of heights or anything like that. I'm just like... I'm just... You know, if something goes wrong, obviously, uh, it's going to go really wrong. So I'm always kind of like, okay, I think I'm going to wait until like I've done everything else off my bucket list before I go parachuting. You know, like when I'm old and gray and I'm happy with my life, <laughs> then I'll throw myself out of a plane. But I know I would enjoy it really much. Like I love all the like free full rides and stuff at the fairgrounds. Um, so it's definitely on my bucket list. I just, it's just like a little further down the road. <laughs> no, Tanley. Oh my God. Someone, someone. No, no, it's shush. <laughs> I had a pretty good week. Thanks for asking Ian. Um, not too much going on just taking time to like chill after work uh work has been super busy so i was like i was all ready and i was about to like load up stream on wednesday and i was just like i just really wanted to sit in the couch and be a couch potato i was like i just need i just need to rest this week uh so i've been doing that um uh, but i will also continue to do that <laughs> But we have we have a, a bit of a, a cozy stream ahead of us today anyway. But I, I don't think I'll go too late. Um, but it's good to be back. I realized I haven't streamed since Monday. It was a really long time ago. Eternity. Uh, for full on healers for the raiding, I'm going in. You're going enhancement shaman. Ooh. I like that you're playing such a hybrid, um, what do you call it? A hybrid class, though. Means we have more healers for our Mythic Plus runs next season. I'm glad you found something that you enjoy anyway. Nice. Ah, uh, breaking the ice. Stanley, you really don't have to break the ice. <laughs> oh my, we're, we're past that. Uh. All right. Are unlocking gliders really, um, really annoying? 
Need a bunch of mastery points? I'd rather do a Barney, take her to a laser tag play. Oh, I've never, ever done laser tag and I've always wanted to do it. Because I'm too chicken to play like paintball. Because I just like, I don't see the point in doing something that's going to inflict pain on me. Like when I went to school, like in high school, lots of the guys in, in my class used to go paintballing like on the weekends, like as a regular. And they would just always come in like Monday morning with these like perfectly round ginormous and super dark like bruises like on their arms and legs and i was just like yeah you know what it it looks really fun it sounds really fun but i'm just gonna be running around for my life just trying not to get hit because i'm just like too much of a wuss so i just um I'm, but like laser tag laser tag it seems like the you know like the pain painless version <laughs> it's always been on my to-do list but i've always like uh, you know get about it or like stuff gets in the way or no one else feels like playing when i suggest it or stuff like that there's a plan for airsoft or paintball you'll be <laughs> doesn't airsoft i don't know which one hurts which which one hurts the most I've shot a lot of airsoft in my day. I've just never been shot with it. If that makes sense. I played so much laser tag, I got blacklisted at the local place for doing shady stuff to win. You're not allowed to cheat. Cheating's not cool, Oliver. No cheats. None should hurt much in proper gear. Well, to be fair, like my classmates probably went with just like t-shirts and helmet, but... I, I, I would get I would get padding like everywhere. <laughs> I just like wrap pillows around myself. Um, hmm. If I'm ever in Stockholm, we're going for it. Uh, what laser tag? Fuck, I'm a. I'd probably be really bad at it, but like I've always wanted to try it. it seems fun. Laser laser tag. I know, I once had a friend that shot himself in the foot with his airsoft gun. He said it hurt a lot, but... <laughs> I'm also like, but why? It's just like, I just want to know what it feels like. Like, how much does it hurt getting shot with it? And I was like, obviously, like a point black range in your foot, it's gonna, <laughs> it's gonna hurt a bit. And it's at the beginning of my last relationship. It was quite steep. We talked about going knowing in one of the largest rivers in our country she misunderstood my when would you have time for it which meant like in a matter of months i asked her on sunday she replied on free monday to thursday so in less than 24 hours everything was booked and planned we we're together for about a week at that point to be honest it was such a good stress stress test of the relationship having head into it like that it's not bad it's not bad I am, uh, I, I feel like I'm liking this whole, like, diving headfirst into relationships and dates on the, on the deep end. Eight rooms. You knowing. <laughs> parachuting. Okay, maybe we should slow down. Maybe not parachuting, but... <laughs> hey, I bet there's people out there that do that. But did your knowing, uh, did it work out well? <laughs> you're not allowed to use other people as shields when you play paintball or a laser tag or whatever that's not nice is there a laser tag place somewhere near on shopping that would be a great activity to do i'm i i'm no idea actually uh kiruma kiruma do you know kiruma you'd be the dream hack more than me i have no idea we'll have to we'll have to investigate we'll have to find out hmm you destroyed equipment by tackling others. Well, that's silly. Yeah, destruction of uh, destruction of property ain't good. Nils, the first the first rule, the first rule of the shop is is do not um do not look at the shop in Guild Wars because you just see all the cool things. You just see all the cool things that you that you want. 
Like, oh my god. Like, now I'm looking at the shop because you said that. Why? Why did you do that? Why did you do that? Oh my god. Okay. Well. Is there a way for revs to use longbows? Oh god. Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> The first rule about Guild Wars 2 is we do not talk about the shop. All right. Well, before we dive into this, I'm going to start a... Do, 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 do. What am I... What am I... What am I talking about? I have no idea. Oh my God, this music is so adventurous. Val, no gem store. We need to progress. Well, I was going to set up a giveaway, though, because I'm giving away my gems because I'm such a nice person, <laughs> obviously. I don't even know how many gems I have left. What's half of that? 650. Buy anything fun for 650? 400, 400, 200, 400, 500. 500, 400, 600, 600. Eh, you can. 500. Plenty of things. 500. Okay, this looks cool. Yo, I can be extra icy. An icy Norn. Love it. Let me win more gems. Yo, yo, chill. Uh, <laughs> there's some good stuff in the gem store. You should get some. There is lots of good stuff in the gem store. But I have become numb to its soft whispers of sparkly and shiny loot. Uh, all right. I'm just gonna kick this off, and I'm gonna leave this this raffle up for a while. Do do do. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Hope you're having a lovely Sunday. Ooh. All right. How do I do this? Giveaways. I feel like we're on an epic quest to like save the kingdom. This music. Gives me purpose. <laughs> Gives me purpose. Okay. Uh. What? Hmm. Yeah, I could probably do like two two-hour raffles or something. Leave it up for a while. Uh, da, 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 da. this is okay. Allow past winners. Yes, require claim. No, I could be nice about that. Hey, right, what what did I do? I tabbed. What am I waiting for? Oh wait! Oh my God, Nils, look at your bunny! Look at your bunny! <gasps> That's a big foot. That's what that is. That is a big foot. So cute. Did the bunny make the goat noises? Goat? Did I just say goat noises? Goat noises. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You gotta use those glider wings again. If that's what you were trying to show off. Make it so people have to join Discord to be eligible. <laughs> I was like, that's one way to get more people to join Discord. Absolutely. I feel like I would have to set that up somehow. I I could definitely do that. Like I could do, but but for a bigger giveaway. I think for this one, we'll just roll with the uh, here. But uh, not bad, not bad. I, I'll do a. Uh, I'll, I'll set up a more lucrative giveaway, and. Uh, Maybe have that on Discord. Hello, Jesta. What's up? Happy weekend. How you doing? Welcome back. Hello. Do I pronounce it? Ailts or Ielts? I probably asked you this before. <laughs> Uh, well, welcome back. Happy weekend. Oh, 
Okay, I'm ready, Nils. Show me these wings and we'll kick off this giveaway. Maybe not wings, glider. <gasps> what? Okay, did you just buy that off the store now? Just foul is fine. <laughs> Uh, thank you for saving my my terrible pronunciation there. Hmm. Yeah, it was a very, very pretty burp. Very, very pretty burp indeed. Very, very nice. Okay, let's see here. Uh, I think this should be good. Okay, maybe I should have written something more than 650 gems, but I will give you just like last giveaway. Any item of your choice for up to 650 gems. Because then we can do two giveaways this stream. Hello, Dick Sonic. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy weekend. Oh, look at these raptors. Yeah, um, exclamation mark. Uh, gems to enter, and you are entered. Thanks, Onyx. So the giveaway is working. We get it's almost over. I know it's really sad. It's very sad. Uh, it's very very sad. Giveaway. Here. And a in a message just. <laughs> it is exclamation mark gems uh to enter let's go in now for for foreseeable future <laughs> And everyone that's done exclamation mark gems has successfully entered. Look at this bunny though. This bunny is so cute. Uh. Hello, Tom from London. <laughs> Welcome. Gems? Not gems, you silly. You silly. <gasps> I didn't even open my loot boxes from the end of last stream. Okay, so let's see. Someone asked, I think, Tanley, what's my progression? Yeah, I'm still in Living World Season 2. Um, I'm halfway. <laughs> Why am I hearing bad? Is it is this your skipper making the bad noises? Because there's only chickens here. I don't even see any sheep anywhere. Why is the bunny making, making sheep noises? <laughs> kind of cute though but yeah so um i finished dragon to reach part two last time uh where i kicked the butt of a little mini little mini plant dragon mordermoth's shadow obviously nothing like the actual dragon that i will kick the butt later and now starting um Chapter 5, Echoes of the Past. Which apparently will sail by smoothly. So I have been told anyway. <laughs> we'll see. <clears throat> uh, but I feel like I got through the first half of Living World Season 2 pretty fast. Just like a couple of streams or something. I've been pretty, uh, been pretty dedicated to getting this done. Maybe the bunny defies is a sheep. But my little... Look at you, look at you. He's so cute. My little buddy doesn't make any bad, bad noises, though. You know, like fat hair. He's so cute, though. I'm do some Living World Season 3 on this so I can teleport there. And... There with other characters. Oh, yeah, I keep on forgetting that. I could technically level up another class and just, like, take off. 
this story. Da 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 da. Uh, the gems are for for Guild Wars Two. Sleepy, sorry. This is there's no wild wow giveaway today. It's Guild Wars Two. Very, very. I can't believe you would say that about this bunny. I put so much faith in you, and you're calling this bunny ugly. Look at it. It's a bunny, dude. It's just got extra big feet. It looks so silly. Get him. Get him. Which you suck. Why is unpin automatically limited from 30 seconds to 30 minutes? Wait, what do you mean by unpin? I, I can unpin... It, it will it will stay pinned until the end of the stream if if i want want it to be or if i pin something new or take it away as a love child of a buddy in a kangaroo <laughs> maybe <laughs> maybe they so cute though that's really cute Hell oh llamas in pajamas oh my god llamas in pajamas just disappeared in front of my eyes so awesome and you wanted to pin it for 120 minutes. Ah, it's fine. I'll remove it manually. A bangaroo. Bungaroo. I like it. I like it. I like it. Not bad. The ballad pajamas. Oh, the childhood TV we had here. So bad. So bad. Okay, I know lots of people love that. I always never. You know, yeah, I, I don't know if that was like, if anyone else in any other countries have ever seen this. But we actually had a children's TV show that was bananas in pajamas. It was a pair of bananas in pajamas. <laughs> Even the concept sounds really, really silly. Oh, well. Oh, well. I couldn't stand banana pajamas. Oh, thank God. I'm so glad. Like, I can't stand, like, over-the-top silly and kind of, like, cringy. I just wanted to watch, like, Powerpuff Girls and Pokemon and Impossible and Totally Spice and all good, like, all the cool stuff. Uh, hmm. Beyblade. I never watched that much Beyblade, actually. Maybe because it wasn't really on TV that much when I used to look anyway. Mm. So, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Uh, totally Spice was great to watch as a kid. I love Totally Spice! Thank you! <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Welcome on day, <laughs> DS Pro. <laughs> I love Totally Spies. They were awesome. And like all of those, all of those shows. 10 out of 10. Like Sonic, thank you for the follow as well. I don't even know what Brodna Fluff is. The heck is Brodna Fluff? I don't know. I feel like when I, when I, when I see what they show on TV now on the kiddies channels. I just feel like it's just not as good as when I grew up. It looks really boring. There's there's always like there's always just someone like either kind of reading from like a book. It's like they're showing like it's like they show the page of a book. Just like a picture. And then someone like narrating the picture and then they like show a new picture and I'm just like, what? What is this? I was like, go read a book then. This is a TV. <laughs> or just like really, really, really badly like cartoon or animated, like really low production, low quality type stuff. You need the good stuff. You need like Pokemans and stuff like that. Doctor Moog, yeah, also nay. 
stuff like that i could not watch oh so cringe so cringe <laughs> i'm so glad this is we <laughs> it's a chat are having fun with this i gave up on tv tv long ago just play young kiddos old tom and jerry <gasps> Tom and Jerry. Obviously, Tom and Jerry was amazing. I used to, I love Tom and Jerry. The pieces. Oh, there were so many good episodes. And there was like the old Tom and Jerry and like the new Tom and Jerry because there was like two different art styles depending on like when the episode was made. It was all amazing. And in, in hindsight, I kind of realized that like Jerry is an asshole. <laughs> I mean, you were always on the, you were always, you were always on, you know, the, the, the little guy's side. You're like on the mouse rooting for Jerry. Um, because, you know, Tom's a scary cat who's trying to eat the poor little mouse. But like now in hindsight, having grown up and understanding more, I just feel sorry for Tom. Jerry's such an asshole. <laughs> like <laughs> Tom's just trying to like live his life <laughs> you know he's just like gonna go to the beach have a nice time and then Jerry's just there trying to wreak havoc and chaos <laughs> what about Brandy and Mrs. Morris wait Brandy and Mrs. Morris I'm also really bad at like names so I have no idea what that is oh yeah I know what that I know I yeah I, I didn't really watch too much of this I've seen a few episodes a little here and there when it's been on TV. Basically, anything sci-fi or fantasy. Don't give me kids shows with animals. If I want to see animals, I'll go out. Do I look like I want to be looking at animals? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what if they're cute animals, though? Fun theory is that Tom and Jerry are best friends. But they needed to be enemies so Tom wouldn't be thrown out because his owner wasn't doing his job oh because otherwise he's a useless cat he needs to be thrown out <laughs> imagine if they were best friends maybe <laughs> thank you for the follow welcome on in i hope you're having a nice weekend oh okay so i kind of like this theory so are we saying that tom Tom is like or Jerry was just trying to like help Tom like that's why he was being an a-hole I, I can live with that there was one show that had a crossover with Totally Spies wait were they what's that I was also like I, this is really girly but I was also a fan of like Wings Club has anyone seen has anyone seen the live action on Netflix it's not great, but I love it anyway. There's two seasons out currently. Okay, this is a really dramatic place. The ghosts of Fort Salma. Been taken over by tentacles. Okay, why is this a season of the tentacles? Like, I'm just saying. But yeah. There was a, there was a lot of good... There was a lot of good TV shows to watch growing up anyway i remember like being homesick from school and then i used to get so mad when like kids tv time was over because the first thing that they used to play every single day as soon as as soon as kitty's kitty's shows was over was um what's that really famous soap opera called uh with the hourglass days of our lives days of our lives oh my god that is the worst TV I have ever seen in my life. Especially as a kid that just wants to watch fun TV. I mean, come on. Mm -mm. I was so disappointed. So disappointed. Because there used to be so something really... can't remember if it was like Pokemon or something that was the last show to come on. And then it was over and then it would be like days of our lives and i just be like oh so boring so cringy uh. oh 
Not sure why auto mod uh, deleted your message there. <laughs> this way, one of those pirated cable TV boxes with a million channels in the early 2000s. So much Cartoon Network, Nickelodeon. I never had one of those boxes. It was not fortunate enough. But I know I like my grandpa did and spending time at his house was like a dream because there were so many kiddies channels you could watch like 24 7. <laughs> uh it was awesome it was awesome for sure oh it might have thought your nickelodeon ie.tc okay it was a link maybe that's why i deleted it Cuba, thank you for the follow welcome on in i was just stupidly happy there was a blu-ray release of the first 37 episodes wait of what are we talking about tom and jerry i hope we're not talking about days of our lives are we Oh, Tom and Jerry. I thought so. I was like... Oh. Uh. Uh. But yeah. Those were the days. Those were the days. Why are these ghosts evil? Oh my god, they're also veterans. Oh my god! I thought they were gonna be like one shot easy. Nay, apparently not. I don't understand Finnish, so that wouldn't have helped me very much. <laughs> oh, but yeah. Good old days. I mean, I don't know. Good good old and good old, to be fair. Now you, we can just turn on whatever streaming service and we can watch, like, kitty shows 24-7. Which is not bad. I don't know. There, there was just something like different back in the day. If you're like homesick or like weekend mornings. You'd be all excited and be like, what show's coming on next? Because you didn't really have a choice. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. I hope you're having a nice weekend, Red. Or three double. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome. What did you respond my head for, Barry? Just like, uh, I just wanted to clarify that we were still talking about Tom and Jerry. I thought you were talking about Days of Our Lives. Yeah. What are you doing? Stay but, uh, hmm. I saw you were talking about Tom and Jerry, so we're good. Feels like the streaming services are kind of lackluster. It feels like a lot, but 90% is not good content. I mean, I think Netflix has gone downhill a little bit. But that but that's just because I, I feel like they're going for quantity over quality these days. But that, I don't know. I think HBO still has a bunch of good things. And like for kids, you know, like every single kiddie show is out there on a streaming service. There's lots of good things for children. Whoa! Oh my god, there's a veteran behind me. Great. This isn't good. My key binding's not working. Whoa! Or my key binding's not working. Aloha. We have an issue here. I can't dodge. <laughs> my, key, my mouse isn't working. I can't dodge. <laughs> oh no. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> it turns out it's really hard to play this game if you can't dodge. Uh, do I need, I need to replug my mouse, maybe? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Uh -huh. Let me just, um,. Double tap also works to do double tap what though? I I rebound. <laughs> Hello, Milan. <laughs> right, I've rebound some of my stuff. So, um, oops, I didn't mean to click that. That works. That one works. 
but for some reason my other keypad is not working. I rebound dodge to to my mouse. I have an MMO mouse, so I rebound dodge there. <laughs> my button to go forward. Uh, that, that I think I unbound that. Yeah, I I, I unbound that. That does not work. <laughs> this this we stutter step then. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh, are you also a new player? Redouble. Welcome to Syria. Why are you not hungover? Oh for fuck's sake, fish. I'm fine. <laughs> Hello. Joe Mene. Okay. What can I call you? Can I call you Yo Yoa? <laughs> Returning player need to farm gold. Uh what's the best way? People do meta trains and get like a bunch of gold. Is isn't that a solid way to, to get some get some quick gold? Do like meta train farming? Someone that knows this game, maybe help. <laughs> okay, wait, I need to figure out why my key bindings are working for some button slots but not for the others this is really weird hmm apparently pvp is quick <sighs> how quick i don't know fractal strikes metas there we go okay this is really weird let me just see if my key binding somehow reset where do i do that control options no, it's still there. Hmm. Hmm. Well, then maybe I'm just gonna unplug my mouse and replug it, maybe? Or should I? Maybe just open my software and see what's going on quickly. Hopefully, quick fix. How are you still where I left you? I'm having issues. <laughs> I entered the instance. I'm having issues with um my mouse. Just I'm just trying to open up my ICU to see what's going on. Yo, Dave, welcome back. How you going? And Tom, thank you for the follow. And Camelos, thank you for the follow. I'm lost. Oh, there's some software updates apparently. <laughs> Let me just see what's going on with my mouse. Mm. Well, my key assignments seem to be... Where they're supposed to be, I think. You're on your way home from a wedding. Oh, was it nice? Any good food? Good drinkies? the ceremony was nice was there no party it's only two o'clock what time is it for you over there tape what you basically need to understand about this game is that gold doesn't work like other mmos the game is going to reward you mostly in materials you can use for something else rather than raw gold that's fair but uh, we like gold <laughs> oh the wedding was yesterday oh that makes so much more sense and apparently hopefully it was a successful wedding um okay i'm just gonna let i'm just gonna replug my mouse and see what icu is doing carl said thank you for the follow hope you're having a nice weekend Bob the Builder! Oh my god, I used to work like BBC Network. BBC Kids. BBC Kids like Blue Peter. That was a big part of my childhood. Bro, I sent in I sent in a I sent in a, like a, a drawing to Blue Peter once and they sent me a goodie bag. That was like the highlight of my childhood. Oh <laughs> uh, uh, my childhood. But uh, what do you need the the twenty gold for exactly? Be right, be in three ish. Okay, let's see. What's my Corsair thing doing? 
maybe updating is the wrong is the wrong thing but i gotta try something because i'm not playing this game without my dodge button i guess worst comes to worst i can rebind it back to the keyboard but i would prefer not to <laughs> player 377 gold girl you have way more than me uh that's only because people have kindly gifted me stuff i only have like uh how how much yeah as you can see all this stuff in my inventory has been has been kindly given to me my account age is 239 days but i've only played for 136 hours so <laughs> i might be a little bit uh unproportional their streamer privileges yeah i met some really nice community folk uh that was basically just to make sure that I had gold to, to buy like the griffin and the jackal and stuff. What is going on right now? I'm so scared. Windows installer? What are you installing on my computer? Uh oh. He still has a kill for the three enemies today we're getting there don't worry i'm just making some really bad life choices right now with my mouse that's all the slow and steady wins the race absolutely um yeah any if anyone uh news popped in hasn't entered the giveaway yet Exclamation mark gems. Enter the raffle. Oh, this is. Whoa, whoa, what happened? Oh, look, my DPI just shot through the roof. Oh, I should really not have done this. It's it's too late to back out now. We're waiting for Mordermoth to die of old age. Absolutely. Do I usually have this high DPI? Maybe I do. I have pretty... Feels a little bit higher than I'm used to. No, this is way too high. I'm messing everything up right now. I'm sitting there with my account drained in golden materials after crafting all the legendary <laughs> roots and sigils. Hey, but now you've got... Now you have legendary roots and sigils, though. <laughs> Wasn't it worth it? 3,200 DPI is a soft spot for me. I don't even know what I had mine on. I think I had mine on 1,500, which means that 3,200 is an insanely high DPI. No? Eight hundred DPI is my standard. Yeah, but you also play you also play Counter Strike, ish. I feel like everyone I know that plays Counter Strike uh, wants to like plays with a really low DPI because you need that. But when I get an elite spec, uh, today, I mean, I, I can unlock it. Uh, hello? <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. That was not part of the plan. Okay. Why can't I hear any Guild Wars music? Can you guys hear Guild Wars music? No sound though. You can hear me, right? 
I can hear myself. You should be able to hear me. You just can't hear. You just can't hear the game, right? What? You can't hear me? I'm not muted. I'm 100% absolutely not muted. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. Uh, that's weird. Um... You guys hear music? You really don't hear me? <laughs> Nothing? Nothing at all? I got music playing, I got games playing. <laughs> what?
Can you hear? That was scuffed. I'm gonna figure out why my mouse isn't working. <laughs> um. Hmm. Sorry about that. I think maybe I've solved the mouse. Not sure. Oh. <clears throat> Hello, Doku. <laughs> And anyone else that came into the stream while I was, uh, stuffing it. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Let's try this again. No, that's why I didn't want to restart my computer, but that was the only way to fix my mouse. At least I think it's working now. That's why I said that was going to be scuffed. Unfortunately. <clears throat> oh, and now my throat is scuffed. Yahoo! We uh we love it when stuff works properly like it's supposed to. Why? Back. I'm sorry about that. Let me just set everything up again. Let's see if this works. Oh, I need a cookie after that. All right, thank you so much for this sub. Thank you for subscribing. Yo, I could use my key bindings again. It worked. All right, let's get this back on track. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, thank you so much. I don't have any cute stickies left. Um, so the rest of the month there is now special <laughs> special wear shaped stickies to go on the wall <laughs> um thank you kindly despite the um ha ah, very scuffed technical difficulties what a cute square Look, it's super cute. <laughs> Just as cute as the penguins and the cats that are already on the wall. Obviously. Obviously, obviously, obviously. Alright. Let's get this show back on the road. Uh, so... <laughs> kind of scuffed that a little bit with the giveaway. Y'all are just gonna have to enter again. Apologies. I'll try to remind anyone returning that already entered that they had to enter again. You didn't win it, Alpha. Because it never completed. Because it didn't save anything. That's why winning the Kirby. Oh my god, Kirby. Uh... Being haunted by Kirby. I almost I almost named this giveaway Kirby. Can you believe this? Can you believe this? I finished typing that I want a quiet shift. I got a call from the fire brigade about falling tree. 
on your alliance? Is there something that's gonna cause difficulty for you guys? Alright, sorry about that, guys. Um... Please... <laughs> Please type in exclamation mark gems to re-enter. And then we cross our fingers that no more scuffy scuffiness happens. Here we go. You're all back in now. Goodies. Goodies gumdrops. Let's try this again. Yes, the yes, the mouse is alive. Moose is alive. We're at the start over again. Because <laughs> I had to restart. Oh no. Oh no. Billy Thou. Alright. I feel like there was something else I had to do. I don't remember. Yo, Balg! <laughs> like time to see. How are you? How's it going? How's our uh, how's our next Hollywood uh, star doing? Have you been up to anything fun lately? Uh, you know what I mean? We'll uh, redo this section. I wasn't even standing that way. Okay, apparently I was. Getting big, getting rolls, getting depressed. I'm trying to finish this damn bachelor thesis. Oh, do you have to write like 500 pages of something annoying? <laughs> but I'm glad that you're uh, you're advancing in your career of choice. <gasps> when are when are we going international, Balg? That's what I wonder. I've been doing good, thank you. I'm busy, busy at work myself. Um, it's going good. I'm trying to catch up with Mickey on on the the story of Guild Wars Two. The man's put in like seven hundred hours into the game already, and it's just like freeze through everything. Good <laughs> luck with that. Ah. Eventually. He's too busy raiding and stuff right now. I'll catch up. For sure. For, for sure. For sure. Hello, Arn Fred. Yo, welcome back. How you been? Happy weekend. I've unfortunately fallen into the path of exile. <laughs> Is it good? It was one of those games I've wanted to try, but I have always been scared away by the amount of, um, well, I guess by the learning curve. There's a lot of systems. There's a lot of things to learn in that game. It's very daunting. Okay, how about this time? Kick some butt. Instead of getting butt kicked. Sounds like a good idea, doesn't it? We're just thinking about 400 hours to understand 10% of it, but once you get the hang of it, it's a marvelous piece of art. I don't have 400 hours to sink into something just for 10% knowledge. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just saying. Mm. But, yeah, thanks. There's so many other games to play. Ah, we're uh, progressing, progressing through through Guild Wars Two for now. Then we'll see. It's Diablo Four though, coming out in June. Are you gonna play it?
Easy. No, no! Get away from me! I'm not a Mordrum! All the Gilrest players don't tell her. What? Don't tell me what? But I need to sink in thousands of hours into this game to understand anything. Okay, I think someone's being squashed by vines. How do I get down there? Can I just jump? I can't just jump. I'm here to save you. Oh, it's me and Marjorie are here. Oh, so lovely. Yeah, we're first on the list. Nah, maybe, nah, maybe. <laughs> At least I'm picking it up on sale <laughs> later on. <laughs> but what about release though? <laughs> I just like the. It's just a game that you can like chill and then play like from the couch or whatever if you want to have it on console. Hello, Tuna. Welcome back. What's up? Oh, cutting. He has a very big sword. It's your sister. Come on. Wait, what's going on? She just imbued herself onto the blade. Are you all right? Linda. She her spirit. Okay, I just want to say I've seen a lot of instances of, of talking blades or blades infused with souls and stuff, and it's never ended well. It's always ended badly. Kill <laughs> me. Oh well, that's cool. You got your uh, sister with you there for a a a, a long time <laughs> as as a sword. <laughs> uh. Only a modern console I got is Nintendo Switch OLED, and that's only used for Nintendo exclusive titles. Uh, I also have a Switch. I don't have the, uh, the, the, like, the regular console version. I have the, I have the light. Just because I wanted something small just to travel with, because we already have a PlayStation 5, so. Is that going to be Frostborn 2.0, Kobe? <laughs> It's gonna be evil. It's gonna corrupt her. <laughs> did I play season one? Yes, I did. I managed to play through all of season one. And now just reached the uh the halfway mark on, on season two. But yeah, there is a giveaway going for an item of your choice. Under 650 gems, I will gift to you once you've decided what you would like. There are rumors about a Switch coming out next year. Really? A new one already? Do we need a new Switch? <laughs> mm, I don't know. When Belinda died, my world turned black. Now I don't know what to feel anymore. <laughs> Belinda fused her soul with the sword. How and why? I don't know. Just have to do some research. Maybe this is a special blade. I just can't believe she did that. Why is she like so outraged that her sister's in her blade? S sister, sisterly rivalry. She's like, I just wanted something for myself, and now my sister's in my sword. <laughs> It'll be okay. Take some time for yourself, Marjorie. Get some rest. No time to rest. Kaz and I are making headway to the Priory. We've got another meeting scheduled with Magister McKay? Mackay? Delaying would be a mistake. We have to arm ourselves against Mordermoth. Yeah, huh? we'll go back to the Priory then. I'm going to check on the pack. Big, quiet, old library is exactly the type of environment I need right now to take my mind off things. We have to get Mordermoth, my friends. I was we will, we will, we will. The spirits of fallen Seraph overwhelmed me. 
Yes, sorry. You guys have to just make sure that you enter the giveaway again. Uh, my computer kind of crashed. <laughs> so, but Bal, Green Double, Balian, Dogu, Tanli, Exonic, Alpha, and Nils. You guys are back in. Anyone else? Exclamation mark gems uh, to join. CDs, welcome back. Happy Sunday. How's it going? If only it was the opposite way, the sword is the sword in the sister. No, that's a really bad way. Sister Ouchie. Ouchie, bye bye. Okay, Explorer Campbell. We were actually sent to back up. I should have waited for you. The ghost almost got me. Why did they think I was Mordrem? I suspect it was their trauma. They died so suddenly. They were confused. Poor things. Well, I owe you a debt. After this, I'm headed to the Silver Waste to further my research. If you find yourself in the area, look me up. I'll treat you to a nice meal. Yo, what's better than food? <laughs> well, that was a shorty. Is the Switch really seven years old? I didn't I didn't realize it was that old. Fair enough. Do I rather want minor runes or minor sigils? Does it, does it even, I don't even know what the difference between runes or sigils are. Team? <laughs> Why do I pick runes or sigils? Uh. Da -da 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 -da. Have I even used any? I don't think so. When I like imbue my weapons with these, the weapons, sorry, my character. What is what? I have a superior rune on this, apparently, that I had no idea. Uh, what? Would you look at that? I don't know if I have any sigil thingies though. What's a sigil? I know I have a lot. I have a lot to learn. Runes you apply them to armor. A complete set has extra effects. Yeah, like I have. Apparently, all of this stuff because I've got rune of the centaur. <laughs> Sigils are something you put onto weapons to proc into something. Oh. Ah, oh, major sigil of fire. There we go. Okay. Cool. Why did I do that? I don't actually have any, um... I don't have a sigil on my staff. Am I a noob then? <laughs> Let's go my noob. Uh... Hmm. Wait, 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 wait. Why are people playing The Witcher on the Nintendo Switch? Can you do that without jailbreaking it? For real skis? Or did we uh did we jump to talking about another console? Are we talking about the No, we're talking about the Switch. We're not talking about the Steam Deck. Oh, I didn't realize it was officially out for the Switch. That's pretty cool actually. Well, I guess we need uh we need we need better handheld consoles. Okay, I have so many loot bags to open right now. We need to fix this. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 what is this? This powerful cluster of foxfire still needs a catalyst to fully unlock its growth potential. I have a bunch of these things. I think someone said I can combine these somehow to make a num nomer for bloodstone dust. Was it all of those items? <gasps> A hero's reward. The hero's reward was terrible. <laughs> Let's open all the loot bags. Is 
Is for a back piece item? I don't think I'm getting any fun stuff in my loot bags. Except for that my loot bags have loot bags. <laughs> As always. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I know these are minor sigils, but it's better than nothing, right? Gain a 30% increased chance to heal allies. Uh, do I look like a healer? Two <laughs> percent strike damage versus ogres. One percent strike damage or inflict nearby foes with bleeding for four seconds after swapping to this weapon in combat. Okay, well I've started weapon swapping in combat. I could put this on my to any weapon. Doesn't matter what weapon I put it on. Um, let's, 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 uh, that into my dagger. Nothing else there. You begin with a mysterious seed and combine it with a lot of materials and other stuff. Visit various locations all over Tyria and in the end it will create an ascended back piece. That sounds like quite the journey. But yeah, I do. I did get a bunch of those items when doing Living World Season Two. Sorry, my throat's going all funny. Advanced lesson in making gold: If you already have superior sigils in your weapons, exotic ones, put the other rarity sigils into the Mystic Forge to craft higher ones. Ooh, so I can combine minor ones. Uh, to better ones. Yeah, my weapons, or that weapon anyway, didn't have anything right now. So I was like, ah, might as well plop it on there. But... I don't... I have two. Is it even worth saving these two to go plop them into the forge later? Sell superior runes for... Quite some profit. Quite some profit. Wait, what? A couple of silver? <laughs> uh, people used to be like, yeah, that's worth so much. And I'm like, whoa. And then I took the trade post and it's like, maybe like a gold or something. And I'm just like, okay. Before I really understood more of like the economy of the game. Uh, but we'll get rid of all this stuff. Da, 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 da. Clear my bags. You know, clear my bags anymore. Oh my goodness. <gasps> it's Raiden. Which I do not want. The spoils of battle. The spoils of battle. Yo, I got some pants. Oh, there's not level 80. They're useless. We get rid of this too then. Gold is huge. Most of the rich players live off microtransactions like that. Really? Yeah, I know. That's what I mean. I have to get used to it because, like, you know, I'm I'm a World of Warcraft like veteran, so <laughs> there there are people have millions of gold. <laughs> uh, and I know the fact that I have three hundred and seventy seven gold is a lot, but. You know, it takes a while to get used to. Streamers don't work. Yeah, we don't. We don't. Why can I not salvage these? Is it because they're exotic? Or am I being Pepega? Is it just doing like that because they're orange? Is there any reason why I wouldn't want to salvage these pants? Probably level... They're only level... Freaking 76. My other exotic stuff that I've saved has been max level. Level 80. Wait a second here. Da 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 da. Da, 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 
da, da, da. This is the amulet I'm currently wearing. I just don't I don't have any any <laughs> What the heck? Okay, wait. What uh What stats are Berserker now again? This is Berserker, right? Power, precision, ferocity. Or is it power, precision, condition, damage? I don't know which one I'm using. <laughs> I mean, I'll be running around with the wrong one. Oh, no. <laughs> Matthew, welcome on in. Thank you for the follow. Hi, have you. Good to see you again. <laughs> Hello, hello, hello. Remember, you have 377 million copper. That's a lot of copper. That's uh, it's a heck of a lot of copper. Okay, but if okay, okay, let me let me let me let me um uh, rephrase my question. If I go, if I go get my my spec which is reaper berserkers are the best stats right berserkers is the best stats for reapers so um power Precision ferocity. Yes, courage was broken. For <laughs> what? Why would it be? Why would it be cool? I want to wield the sword. Okay, I'm just gonna put berserkers. I totally knew that the names were there. By the way, <laughs> obviously. Oh, sorry. We're deciding what content you want to focus on. We have to do. Do we have to? Do we have to decide right now? <laughs> I mean, I have two different. I have two different builds, or I have two different armor sets anyway. For now, um, but I think I'm gonna be starting with you know like exploration and yeah, open world PVE. Oh, my cat's being so cute right now. Um, but I mean, I would also obviously like to do dungeons and like you know fractals and raids as as well at some point. Take a pick and share, please. Of what? Oh, my kitty cat. Oh, she already shifted. She was cute for like five seconds and now she's just sleeping. <laughs> uh. Four Necro is currently meta? What? But, but why would core neck? You mean core Necro without taking an elite specialization? Is that actually, is that actually better than being, uh, a Harbinger, a Scourge, or Reaper? Really? See, this is also where, like, this this messes with my brain a little bit, because I would just, like, assume that an Elite spec would be sort of a little bit more powerful somehow. Power Reaper is getting a big buff next week. <laughs> uh... For core builds, Necro is one of the strongest you see for a weapon is Shroud. I need to get I need to get better with using Shroud. I think I have become better, but yeah. I know it's the WoW brain. Actually, I don't even know if it's the WoW brain. It might be like the League brain. I keep on thinking that it's like I've unlocked my ultimate or like in Overwatch or something. <laughs> but at least fix all to the place I'll not improve or upgrade or whatever. Okay, but you know what? We're just I'm gonna just put Berserker stats in this. It's just one Nick. Is this one choice 
is this one choice gonna it's gonna change my guild wars experience for the rest of my life so we'll just put berserkers in that did a thing I did a thing we're that thank you cover over the f1 can you see how short the cooldown is um what 10 seconds I also need to like build up my my life force because that gets drained Sometimes when I'm not paying attention to and build it up. Sometimes you need to replenish it. Nothing I do at this point is a permanent decision. Thank you. It makes me feel good. When are we doing dungeons? I don't know. When I feel like it's time. Is <laughs> that a good enough answer? <laughs> like, no. No, it's not that. Buying a full exotic set for open world should be about 10 to 15 gold, I think. So it's not that big of a deal. All right, cool. Because I think I got Berserkers and I got Sed. Is it Seds? This one? No. I know the set is called Seds. Not this one, sorry. Viper. Viper? Power, precision, condition, damage? Or was this the Celestial set? We were talking about this before. Because that was the reason I had two sets. I don't know if you, some of you guys were there before. And it was like, one was like pure damage and one was something else. Celestial is the all around build. Yeah, I remember there was like an argument in chat of which one was like the best for me to go with. <laughs> uh, but okay, anyways, we did that. Clear my bags. A little bit still need to go visit a bank at some point it's getting very very messy in here unfortunately my main necro is on na otherwise i would show how easy i swap instantly to reaper when you scourge or heal scourge how dare you how dare you have it on na tuna <laughs> imagine having that big bags and big bags was is was always is always a priority for me when I play MMOs. You guys should know that. <gasps> oh my god, reunion with the pact. We're going somewhere where I don't have never been before. When I have full bags, I just put everything to auction. What if you auction something that you need? <laughs> that will be good for later. <laughs> oh. Hmm. <gasps> it's the it's the OG evil plant dude. This is the OG salad that this is where it all started. I blame I blame Traherne for Tybalt. For planning an assault in Mordermoth at Camp Resolve, our new staging area in the Silver Wastes. Time has come for all to stand and deliver, and I would like you to assist in our preparations here. I have a specific mission for you if you're game. The Sereth of Krita have secured a new route to our staging area in Fort Vandal. Evidence suggests the bandits hastily abandoned the location recently. The guards posted there may no more. Please journey safely. The increased Mordrum activity is making travel especially dangerous. I laugh in the face of danger. Obviously. Hmm. Okay, question. What's the smartest way to get here? This is funny because I was kind of here before when I got lost. But of course there isn't any waypoints here that I took. I guess it's that waypoint is the closest. Or can I go this way? I don't know. This feels this feels like a more straightforward way. I'm so gonna get lost that way. This is the closest waypoint I have. Venlin? What the heck is Venlin? 
I don't have anything called Fenlin. You guys are making shit up now. I don't I haven't I haven't unlocked the waypoint. Literally the waypoint I hovered over. But the fucking Oh, you're calling it Venlin because of all I saw was Murat Bor <laughs> Murat. <laughs> it's like this isn't Venlin. I don't even know how you're supposed to pronounce that. Who puts an R after an F? <laughs> Ooh, uh, that's pretty. Yoo. Okay. I went this way before I can do it again. Right? Uh oh. Sorry, apparently raptors are not allowed to climb upstairs. I apologize. Val, I'll meet you when I've gotten my spec and lock deal. Okay, good. <laughs> Wait, what? Reaper? Reaper. Yeah, I'm gonna try a Reaper. I'm just I don't wanna I don't wanna have to be dealing with too many new things at once. I'm learning all the new tactics and stuff. I gotta learn my combat skills. I gotta learn oh, look at this I don't even know what you are. The spirit. Very tranquil and peaceful. What the heck is Zim Zim? Okay, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that. All I see there is Zim. I don't. I'm ignoring the L. <laughs> Next time I go to some arcade, I'm gonna like, I'd like some Zim Zim, please. Can I have some Zim Zim. <laughs> it's like what? It's not even close. Oh, all these toxic things everywhere. I love ice cream, guys. It's ice cream season again. And like all our convenience stores right now in the country have like have a deal on ice cream, so all ice cream is 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 half off. I only pay half the price right now. I'm like, I'm just always constantly just looking for an excuse to pass by a convenience store now. It's amazing. <gasps> I see another Mr. Bunny. Don't make me pull out the I. Wait, what's the I word? <laughs> I, whatever, whatever you want to say, it's not there. Okay, wait. There was not a waypoint there. That was a portal. Where was the waypoint? Oh, oh no, the waypoint was all the way down there. Ah, well. Okay, we should probably go get it. To be fair. Yoo this is what happens when you pay attention to Cham. Let's. I'm just gonna get the waypoint quickly, and then. Da 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 da. What else do we got here? Two other things. Oh no, there's a wall. <gasps> Mister Mister Bunny cannot jump that that fierce of a wall. Ooh. What type of Reaper will you go? Uh, minion master or great sword. Oof, I have no clue. I have not gotten that far yet. Uh, but I like this out of both. But I a great sword. Cause I wanna I wanna run around and I wanna wield a sword. Like how cool. How cool would I look if I ran around, if I ran around with a sword? I'd be like Polka. I mean, come on. This is a really tiny sword, though, but I've seen bigger. What are you guys? Oh, I wish I had the I wish I had the the not the tiny one. But unfortunately, I don't have I do have this is a great sword, right? That's uh, that's got to be a big one. <laughs> There's no way this is not a great sword. Two hands, right? So I got one. <laughs> I got one skin.
It's massive. This is why I'm also hunched over because I can't quite carry it. I also think I have a candy cane one. How do I wait? How do I know if it's a tiny sword or a big sword? See, I know that's a great sword or whatever other sword it's called. Just a sword. Does this say great sword? Okay, it's a sword and great sword. Okay. That is an axe. Never mind. And that is a sword. Okay, never mind. I didn't have a giant candy cane one. I thought I did. I have I have that. I have the packed packed Avenger, which is very fitting for me, to be fair. Hey Freyas, welcome back. What's up? Happy weekend. You will get a great sword with a spec unlock. Oh they give me one for free. Awesome. Okay. What's that? Roller beetle time trial. I I suck at the roller beetle. Absolutely suck. No, this is the same character. <laughs> We're just talking about me unlocking my elite spec. Then I get to uh then I get to wield a a sword, a great sword. I'm gonna look so cool. But I'm gonna kind of miss not being able to go between ranged and melee, or can I still do that? As a reaper, how does that work? Because now obviously I can either have my staff or I can go zug zug with my daggers and extra like lifesteal and stuff. I guess we'll find out later to be continued until someone says something. Watch your step, something odd is afoot. I don't know if I can take you seriously after that pun. <laughs> it was an accidental pun. You know, I do accidental puns all the time. Really ought to watch yourself. Yeah, because this route is... Okay, seriously, why? Just go somewhere else, dude. Hmm. Something here caused a triad to, to vacate Fort Vandal. Good for us, maybe. Unless what scared them off was worse. You always know when something's running away, there's something bigger happening. Just look at it when all the all the big ele elephants, when all the big dinosaurs run away from the T-Rex. <laughs> in Jurassic Park. <gasps> What's this? Wait, I can't click it. Why can't I click it? There. Oh my god, this would look awesome. Wait, is this the one I get? Dark Harvest Reaper Greatsword. That sounds like a necro thing. It fits me so well. Like with my current. Oh my god. Glad to be here. Now <sighs> give me some ice cream. <laughs> yes, we want ice cream. I also want ice cream. 18 months of Al not wanting to see a movie with me in cinema, Ariana Sage. <laughs> Hello, Shadowboard. Hi, Carl. I'm sorry, I'm not going to go see the spider movie. <laughs> Absolutely not. How are you guys doing? Happy weekend. Thank you so much for the resubs. 28 and 18 months. Thank you, guys. Welcome on in. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <gasps> yes. Thank you for converting from Prime to a Tier 1 Subby. Thank you guys for kicking off a hype train. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> okay, I have scuffed stickies. Oh my god, I died! Because I was a big assist. <laughs> you guys distracted me with a hype train so much. That I died in the game. And the sword is amazing, by the way. I can't believe. I wanted to watch the World Origami Championships tonight, but it was pay-per-view. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Hmm. Also, why did you put me on this path, Val? The one... The, the most recessed. Wait, what? What are you talking about, guest? 
What path have I put you on? I hate when people call me a windmill. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not a big fan. Hello. Oh my god, you look so cool. Definitely knew that was tuna. I feel so bad when I have to go like into my cheat sheet to see like who's who. <laughs> Did you just stroke your sword? Eight months since you began streaming GW2R1. <laughs> what the heck is going on? Oh my god, thank you guys so much for all the resubs. <laughs> thank you, Tanley. Eight months. Eight months. We have finally made it to Living World Season 2. <laughs> How does it feel? <laughs> Uh, may I post a link to some builds? Yeah, give me a second. I just need to permit. No, you can. Oh my goodness, guys. So you had to fold on those plants? <laughs> oh no, we have more puns and dad jokes. Hello, Courtney. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Guess the rabbit hole that is Kitty's TV shows is amazing. Be happy. Sorry, my throat's still being really weird. Yes, thank you so much for the level 2 hype train. Thank you. <laughs> okay, I don't have cute stickies anymore. I'm sorry. I'm going to get cute stickies next month. I re ran out. But I have some nice... I have some, some nice... Some nice regular stickies. <laughs> thank you so much for all the resubs. I really appreciate you guys. Hello, Frogman. Welcome back. What's up? How you doing? Also, remember, if you guys play Guild Wars, I'm doing a giveaway for an item of your choice, up to 650 gems in the shop. If you, uh, if you want to join, it's exclamation mark, uh, exclamation mark gems to join. <clears throat> Eight months up to season two is good. Then you haven't pushed the story and enjoyed the game. I, <laughs> I um, <clears throat> I've been I've been taking it slow, but I also play other games. So like my main game is is World of Warcraft. I've been uh, been playing them both like often off and on. Uh, and then I decided that I wanted to do everything and like. Chronological order in Guild Wars. So yeah, taking it step by step. Sorry, my throat's being like a mess. Thank you for linking the builds, uh, Arnfred. Thank you. Rest in peace, boiling water. You'll be missed. <laughs> yes, Carl, I saw it. Now, nah, Val, this is now my main game. Well, currently it's my main game, I guess. Yeah, I have been doing a lot of Guild Wars. I've been doing a lot of Guild Wars lately. So I haven't been here for a while. I've been watching Shame Shameless. <laughs> oh, don't apologize. It's good to see you again. And no one ever has to has to say sorry for missing a stream. I understand that everyone has lives, things to do, activities to attend. But uh, hopefully I'll be here whenever you want to tune in again. I hope you're doing well, Sebu says, by the way. Welcome back. And hello again, big boss. <laughs> uh, happy weekend. Okay, let me get some stickies on the wall. Uh, and thank you guys again very much for the level 2 hype train. Carl, Shadow Morn. Oh, there's a Carl sticky and a Shadow sticky. But yeah, I'm. I haven't stopped playing WoW or anything. We'll continue with that. It's just uh, I've just been really enjoying Guild Wars at the moment. That is all. Pride wing, Pride wing. Red, thank you so much for the resub. Thank you for your prime. <gasps> thank you very much. 
for your prime. Be coming up. Mode check, do I need permission for a message with a link? No, uh, subbies should be fine for posting links. Stream Elements just uh, doesn't like when non-subbies post links as a form of protection. <gasps> Wormies puppy, <laughs> welcome. Hope you're having a lovely weekend, good luck. Alright, Shadow. Holy crap! Rokma, thank you so much for the five gifted subs to the community. <laughs> thank you. What the heck? <laughs> that is very kind of you. Thank you, thank you. Oh my god, the Pika emote. That alert is so old. <laughs> Pika, thank you so much. Okay, let me start handing out more stickies. Oh my goodness. <gasps> you got so many lovely people in that gift bomb. Why are you skipping jokes? I'm trying to keep up, Carl. Stickies, not stinkies. Stickies. Oh, uh, and gratitude and everyone coming in to say hi. Oh my goodness. I hate autocorrect is always making me say things I don't intend to. <laughs> that was actually funny. Thank you, Frogman. Okay. Um. Whoa. Streamer slightly overwhelmed. Uh, Carl, Shadow, uh, Tanley. Keeping track of how long I've been uh, streaming Guild Wars 2. Bury me with my old records. It'll be my final resting place. No bad puns. No bad puns. Arnfred. Oh, I have to spell it. With a three. What's the worst season to be a free climber? Winter, fall, I don't know. Free. <laughs> uh, summer, spring, fall, fall. Fall. Uh. <laughs> Now Cross can be like, damn it. I gotta change it up. Obviously. <laughs> oh. I got one. It might be the easiest one in the book, but at least I got it, guys. Awesome. Yeah, clearly awesome. Um Frogman. Oh, how did I fit that in one sticky? I have no idea. I used to do I used to do hearts on stickies for sub bombs when we had the old stickies. Let's bring that back. Why are pretzels called pretzels? Because Because pretzels. <laughs> I don't know. Frogman, thank you so much for that sub bomb. I really appreciate it. With your fancy little sticky. And guest, thank you very much for converting your prime into a subscription as well. And for all your support, guest, you are amazing. He's probably not even here. Never giving you a compliment again, guest. If you guys like dad jokes, you'll love this. My son was acting up and started chewing on... Your son was acting up and started chewing on electrical wires. I had to growl to him. He's doing better at currently conducting himself properly. 
I wish I could take credit for that, but it was a copy pad. <laughs> it was a good one. It was a good one. <clears throat> I need to get back to this pretzel one. Why are pretzels called pretzels? Because they're not bread. Because they're not breads. Oh my god. Yes, yes, I get it. They're not bread. I get it. Hi, Tuna. Are you. Are Tuna's boobas bigger than mine? Like, have we. We just. Your outfit makes them look bigger than mine. This is very suspect. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like, I don't remember there being a booba slider. What's going on here? Just saying. Just saying. Some outfits make you look flat. I mean, I don't think my character looks flat. <laughs> but okay. <laughs> All right. This time I'm not going to die to some random vine attacking me while being distracted by you guys. Hmm. Uh, anyway <laughs> who doesn't it's something i think it's something that a lot of people appreciate nothing nothing wrong with some boobas right nothing wrong with that nothing wrong with that oh <gasps> merchant oh my god i can sell all my junk to this guy and he'll be super happy okay i didn't have that much junk it was a little bit of junk anyway You'll know if it's one of mine and my dad jokes are so bad they have to be dreadful. <laughs> I didn't know there was a level of dad jokes that were that um <clears throat> vintage, <laughs> so to speak. Epic! Hello, Epic! How are you? Welcome back. What's up? Here's some changes for some body cells to make the booba bigger or smaller. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, wait. I need your help. Now, I, I keep on asking this, but I'm going to keep on asking this until someone remembers what that was. Hey, Razor Beast. Welcome back. How are you? Okay. When we were doing the adventure box, super adventure box, there was... There was a... A, a, a person, a player, wearing like a cosmic outfit. And I keep on forgetting what it's called. I'm going to write it down now if anyone remembers what it's called. She was... She, her skin was entirely cosmic. It just looked like space. And then was wearing like a tiny little bikini to cover up like the bits. But yeah, it, it basically looked like... You know, like... Uh, like the, 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 the... Whatever, like her skin kind of looked like this starborn outfit starborn Guild wars 2 she looked amazing yes that's the one Just, okay i understand why she wasn't wearing the headpiece though but that outfit is sick <laughs> i was like oh my god i want this it looks so good Go to hero outfits, you can preview. Oh, man. I think you're giving yourself heart attacks in hardcore classic. Why would you do that? What level are you in hardcore now, Epic? Or what were we doing? Uh, Outfits? Oh. No, okay. Well, actually, this looked pretty sick, too. Wait, what do we call it? What the? Oh, my God. Yes dyed in another better color this is a very this is a very plain and simple one i think it's so cool i mean i'm not like the i'm not i'm not okay i know i'm gonna i'm gonna say this not running around like this i uh, know this isn't really slow mug i'm not really one for slow mug in this sense i like feeling like i'm wearing decent armor or at least something that looks nice or makes me feel powerful or whatever but this is i think this is so cool just because of how you just look like a cosmic being i look like space it's awesome hello mario <laughs> mm. 
Hello, Sam, sweetie. Welcome back. Colonel Helm, though. So, okay, wait. I, how did I do that? Do I have to do it? Uh, wait. I don't remember how I did this. I done. Oh God. <laughs> Just don't pay attention to what this looks like. <clears throat> um. I don't know, like it's kind of cool with the headpiece as well, but I, I like, I like my Norn hair. I, I don't know, I really like, like in case you haven't noticed, I like hair. <laughs> I have long hair in real life. I like having flowing hair in game too. Um. Mm. Why are you lost, Frog? <laughs> Don't you think this looks cool? This set looks really cool, though. There's so many sets that look amazing. Okay, you know what? I haven't ever looked through these before. We could spend so much time here. We should, we should, we should do that, right? Runs in mist match coloring. I swear I'm not new, but I don't care what that looks like because I'm wearing an outfit, right? That's covering that. That's why. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's got little twinkling gems. I didn't even realize that when I first looked at it. Powerful like your death itself. Brent, Brent Regalia outfit. What does that look like? Okay. No, you know what? This immediately made me think of. This is Reaper from Overwatch. That's what this is. <laughs> Careful, or would the green marker are currently available? <laughs> available for purchase. <gasps> no, that means I can't buy the starboard outfit. Okay, how do I get this? Do I just have to wait until this comes back into rotation in the in the shop? Or is this one of those things where I have to get super lucky with some freaking black chest? You wait? Okay, I just wait. Okay, that's fine. I'm a patient person. I can wait. Patience is my middle name. Like... Uh, kind of not really, but I'll do my best. Oh, uh, this is a loot book statue when you can't directly buy it from this. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm uh, saving up on lion statues. Is this what you're saying? I can do that. I think I put them on my bank. I got two. I got two black light statues. Is that gonna get me anything? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Why are these so cool though? <laughs> Maester, welcome on in. Thank you for the follow. Happy weekend. Click it, you can check it now. What use? Oh right, I can see what there is to purchase. Ah, Crafting materials for thingies. Fishing rods, double render cape, some, some breastplates. Oh, that was kind of evil. There's just so much stuff for me to look at everywhere. This is, this is not a good idea. It looks like I'm going to need quite a lot of tickets. Because these are like 45 a piece. Ooh. Hello, evil. Oh, I could have dragon horns. Oh, holy crap. Bro, I need more. I need more tickets. How cool. This uh, seven reaper skin is pretty. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty pog. Oh. <gasps> Oh my goodness. And then some other things. A ghost pepper. Oh, look at that. Ghost pepper. I need another coffee for this. We're done soon, I swear. I'll check out the Vermilion Greatsword skin. Where do I do that? How do I how do I how do how do I find that? Oh, it's somewhere in the statues re statuettes reward. Uh 
Vermilion. 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 I found a vermilion bow. It's a blood flame sword skin. Oh, that's evil. What does that look like? Oh, Yin, look at this bow. It's awesome. Oh, here we go. Oh my god. Okay, wait. <laughs> There's too much stuff going on right now. Whoa, that's a big sword. Oh, where did you go? Go, go somewhere else. That is awesome. If you have like an entire set or outfit dedicated to matching with this. I forgot how many Black Lion statues heads I have. I've been tossing them in the back whenever I get them. <gasps> yes, I said such nice things about you earlier and you're coming in and saying things like that. Shame. Shame. <laughs> These are really cool things. There's also a vermilion throne. Like this chair is beautiful. Holy crap. Can this is probably a really silly question, but can you can you die chairs? Can you die weapons? You can't die weapons, can you? Oh, I've got something stuck in my throat, I apologize. I just realized I've never thought about that. You can only die, like, armor, equipment. You get weapon skins, but they can't change color. Oh, you can't die weapons. No, okay, I thought so. Oh, but this would be so cool in, like, every other color as well. I mean, it's beautiful in red, but... But armors and mounts. That is fair. That is fair. Wait, why do I look like this? What did I... What did I do? Hmm. Because we were looking at all these outfits. And I think I clicked that. That's why I probably clicked that. Hmm. Look at all these cool out. Whoa. Uh, what happened to. Oh, no, this is creepy. Look at these hands coming up to grab me. <laughs> they just follow me if you run around. <gasps> My goodness. Hmm. Okay, yep. This is what Nick Fury would look like if he uh, was in an alternate reality. Some of this stuff is so beautiful. Or so cool. <laughs> oh, the Whoa, why, why do I feel like... This, this kind of... Yeah. Well, everyone that's been here for a while knows. <laughs> Just moving on. Oh. These are so cool. I've never looked at these properly before. Okay, I kind of already have that outfit. Okay, I don't know why my eyes are watering now. <laughs> what cooking stream? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Else everyone will be running around with neon pink weapons, pretending that they're attacking everything with their most lightsaber. <laughs> if I could have a pink lightsaber, lightsaber, I would have a pink lightsaber. That made outfit is the entry to any raid that doesn't require legendary inside. <laughs> The main outfit was also what do you think? <laughs> Hello, Hayden. <hate. laughs> oh, this is what well, I didn't. Apparently, it's available for purchase still. But Mad King's outfit, so like during Halloween. Okay, this is pretty cool as well. As a, I mean, as a necromancer, this is a very uh, fitting skin. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is also pretty cool. Why wow, there's so many cool stuff. They're all showing up as purple because that's like the choice of my transmog, right? Like, or that's the color that I've dyed my outfit to. I'm assuming, or otherwise, for some reason, every single set in this game is purple. <laughs> I love purple. No complaints. Yeah. Uh. This is this just this just makes me think that I'm a boss. Forged outfit. Hello, I'm your raid boss. Um, <laughs> I really want to say something really appropriate, inappropriate. There, I'm not gonna say it, but yeah. 
Come, uh, <laughs> come kick my butt. Uh, whoops. Um, no really sure what's going on here, but okay. If I ever wanted to look like an owl, <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. Sophisticated mist strangers. Samurai outfit. Oh, kitty cat. Or maybe a wolf. Never mind, it was a wolf, but it kind of looked like a kitty cat as well. Slayer's outfit. Exa exemplar attire. What are we going to? This is uh, Moulin Rouge. Shadow Assassin. Oh my god, why they're all so cool. They're all so cool. Wait, didn't someone say Shrine Guardian? Wait, did I see that one? What's going on with these heels? Am I levitating on small little balls? <laughs> but the kitty cat ears though. Can I just have the kitty cat ears and nothing else? Look at it. This is awesome. They definitely missed out on the opportunity to put a little tail in there though. Wait, what is this if you just die? <laughs> there is that actually, or is that a joke that I don't know about? Is that a Guild Wars meme or is there actually a raid boss that's where you're just staring at thighs because the boss is so big? Okay, maybe no spoilers. <laughs> yes, purple is the best color. I can't wait to be able, I can't wait to move and to get fill a few lights and just make like a nice white and purple environment to sit and stream in what was the what was iron that but 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 yeah <laughs> what <laughs> hmm See, this is what I mean though with like the the, the boobage. <laughs> it looks super tiny here. <laughs> compared to like compared to this. It's like how did they just change sizes that dramatically? <laughs> <clears throat> Your character looks much better wearing that compared to mine. Why just what? What what um what race are you playing? I suppose most things look normal and a norn and like humanoid. It'd be interesting to see what everything looks like on a, like a char. It's such a different model. Do you guys find that like headpieces look funky on, on char? I'm just thinking because how very different their heads are. It might look... uh. I don't know if there's like if it looks weird and you have a hard time finding outfits that like look good this is what i should be wearing when i run around in norn land but oh no i think char of the torrents of guild wars 2 regarding helmets yeah i think like that's what i mean like in in world of warcraft the the, the torrent which are like basically giant like full humanoids or cows or whatever moo moos they they don't always fit really well in like helmets i was wondering if it was like the same for char oh my god i look like a salad oh that was nice anyways not getting distracted by this. <laughs> I just um I just wanted to have a peek. Because so I realized I've never really looked properly at like transformer stuff. I've just been oh it's so pretty. I kind of have a hate love relationship to this to be fair. But Yeah, I've been drooling over mounts so much. I've never really looked too much at what kind of uh what kind of fashion is available. I've only seen everyone else run around with like cool stuff. Hello, Guru. Welcome. Thank you for the follow. 
Good luck. You've all, uh, all entered successfully, by the way, that have entered. Got 30 minutes left until the draw. The Azura have a special argumentation council for booba related changes. <laughs> oh, you can always get distracted by fashion. Yo, that's the best part of any MMO. Maybe not the best, but if we count if we count mounts into fashion, then I would say it's the best part. I mean, and wow, I love collecting mounts. If you open the shop, you can see the cat ears you can get. Actually, um, I did have... Oh, let's see. Where do I find that? Is it in my wardrobe? Yes. I has been gifted this one and this one. I have... I have... <laughs> I have... I have two cat ear things. Um... When I was running around with my winter outfit, I had these ears. They're very cute. I don't even know what else I have in here, actually. This, I got some evil face thing. Yara. Something weird about my eyes. Yara. Uh, unleash my inner Illidan. Another, another gem. Those are the ones I got. I don't want to see the cat ears. I'm gonna want them. Oh, by the way, Yin, uh, I did see, I did see the Dota updates. My coworker was busy uh, having a gasm about them for like half an hour uh, <laughs> the other day when they were released. Or I just realized now that you answered before, or you asked that before. Very cool. It kind of feels like that's a Dota three, not just like an update for Dota. Uh, hope you're excited about it. Franco, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. And Fallon, welcome back. How you doing? Uh, regarding the giveaway, is it going to be a code? I'm asking because anyone that uses the Steam account can redeem gem codes. No, so what it's going to be is I'll just uh, I'll gift it to you through an item of your choice uh, that is worth up to 650 gems. Is there not a pinned message anymore? To be fair, you guys might delete, remove the pinned messages right away because they're really annoying. <laughs> Let me know if there isn't a pinned message though, because it, um, it should have had it should have the deets. But yeah, you uh, you get to pick an item of your choice, worth up to six hundred and fifty gems, and then I will whoa get attacked. I'll add you and send it to you. It unpins after 30 minutes, I think. Hmm, I'd set it to... I thought I set it to, uh... Stay until the end of stream. Oh, well. Thank you. Hello, Nomik. Welcome back. Why did I even get off my raptor? Hello, Branko. Um, okay. Show me these really quick and then we'll continue with the story. <laughs> what is you? I type cat. Oh my God. Why am I being attacked again? Leave me alone, you tendril roots. Ferocious. Ferocious. Little cat. Little cat ears. Oh no. Why would it show me this? Why do I have to look? <laughs> Why? I keep on forgetting that I'm wearing an outfit. And in order to wear my outfit, I cannot wear anything else. Can you not can you not even combine can you not even combine a headpiece with an outfit? No, you can't. Because you can only choose whether to hide or to show the headpiece of an outfit. Or an item that you have transmuted or transmogged, as I like to call it. Then I'd have to I need to find a, another dashing set to use so I can uh 
I'm so, I'm so, I was like, I'm so embarrassed by what this looks like. Can we just ignore the rest of my outfit <laughs> for a while? <laughs> uh, I am having fun with Necro, yes. I'm, uh, I'm gonna be exploring the Reaper Elite spec in a bit and see what I feel about that. Thank you for the follow, by the way. I'm doing well, Ranko. I hope you've had a lovely weekend. Hopefully, anyway. I'm uh, trying to do the best of my Sunday before having to go back to the office tomorrow. <laughs> Oof. All right. Yeah. Giveaway ends in 25 minutes. Exclamation mark gems. Uh, making sure this works. Yeah. Everyone that's claimed a ticket is in. He Marius he or Marius maybe just <laughs> welcome welcome <gasps> here's my cat hello CSI how you doing the one of my cats my other cat's been sleeping behind my monitor the entire stream how you doing you good you've been a new he's been going through he's been going through a little bit of a of a what do you call it a phase He's been going through a little bit of a phase lately. He's been super needy. He's been meowing like lots for attention, for more play. It's really hard. It's a really hard balance between giving him the attention and then also not like feeding into his meowings. So I usually have to wait for his like temper tantrum to end. And then when he's quiet, then he gets some treatos. And then we play. Because I don't want to teach him that like if he throws a tantrum... Like, that's when he gets the good stuff. <laughs> I don't really teach you the wrong things. But you get treats when you're quiet, don't you? And you're a good boy. We have a full screen cat minute. He's, uh, he's, he's like, no, he's like, now I'm out. Hi. For you, you want these creatures? <laughs> Look at those lazy eyes. He's like, this is amazing. <laughs> I'm so glad my cats don't throw tantrums. <laughs> He's just so like our other cat is super quiet. She doesn't hardly do anything. Um, she's yeah. She likes to talk in the mornings. She's like, oh, you're awake. It's nice, and we have some scritch exchanges and stuff, but. Um, yeah, this guy, he likes the good things in life. It's just like, I think he's got a bit of like separation anxiety as well. He doesn't like being alone for too long. Kind of like, he's kind of needy mama's boy, that vibes. Um, he's a good cat. He's a good guy. He just craves extra, extra attentions. He doesn't like do anything. He doesn't go on like a destruction rampage like to keep himself happy he doesn't tear the place down or anything he just like goes to another room and like starts meowing <laughs> it's just like come over i want attention bye he's a good boy aren't ya <gasps> oh yeah <laughs> you glowed him yeah who wants to win a giveaway of a cat <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> Caesar? Look what you did to me. Look what you did. <laughs> this cat. How many times am I gonna have to return to this waypoint? <laughs> you got me dead. You got me dead. You silly. This is what happens. We give. We give cat scratches and <laughs> and then we die. <laughs> this cat can get away with murder. This cat has done a lot of things. A lot of horrible things in this lifetime. You killed my Deathwing statue. That's the only thing I will ever remember. Of all the bad things he's done. He's a good boy. 
Welcome back, Hanley. Are you really gonna sleep on my arm right now? Okay, I can move my I can move my hand a little bit. Can't move my arm though. He's he's actually he's actually laying down on my arm right now. Thanks, cat. Thanks. Yeah, I had a giant statue. Worth uh Ah, quite a lot of Deathwing from World of Warcraft that he broke. It was a sad moment. It was a sad moment of my life. Nice great sword for you when you go Reaper. Oh, oh what? This is from my any account to make these. So I suppose I don't need five in my bag. But read the weapon description carefully. Oh my god, this vine. In the Mystic Forge, combine with Gift of Dragon Spite, Gift of Jade Mastery, and Draconic Tribute to create the legendary Greatsword. Or Orin? Orin's Bite? What? Is this. Is this. Is this how you make legendaries in this game? This is the base. This is like the, the 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 base weapon or whatever, and then I just need to get all the other things. I just need. I probably that's probably gonna take me like a year of my life. <laughs> Whoa! I have no idea how cool this is, but <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel so bad. This is like when Short gifted me the Bifrost, and I'm like, "Yo, it's so cool!" And everyone's like, "Yeah, you have no idea how cool that actually is." Thank you. What does it look like? It looks like... Oh my goodness. It looks like ice. Dragon Spite. This is... This is Jormund that, uh, that did something with this sword. Whoa. It's all... It's all shiny. It kind of looks like a dragon. I don't know if that's me just trying to see things. Okay, maybe that's just me trying to see things. Thank you very much, Tuna. Now I will have an awesome sword to run around with when I become Reaper. The Reaper. Reap. <laughs> I'm losing. I'm losing blood to my hand. <laughs> I don't want to push him off though, cause he's so he's so cute and he's so needy. <laughs> He might get upset and throw a tantrum <laughs> if he thinks I don't want to cuddle with him. <laughs> Thank you very much, Tuna. Um, you've also now set forth a new mission for me that will definitely not be started anytime soon. But um, one day, maybe I'll start to research how to uh, get one of these other uh ingredients maybe this will be the first legendary i ever try to make unless you guys are telling me that uh it's gonna be like impossible <laughs> isn't this the same <laughs> fpc a lot happened a lot happened a lot happened since since then hi tuna i've been attacked by tendrils i died twice oh <gasps> um and yeah and then a cat as a cat is sleeping on my arm that is a star from the same generation of legendaries Ooh. okay so i got a really really cool sword that one looks very nice very nice indeed. Gitanli's mad at me because I haven't progressed the story at all <laughs> since I started this stream. Actually, that's a lie. I completed one whole chapter. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it would be cool. I'm looking forward to trying to tackle like a legendary as well. But I need to progress the story first. I want to do that. Um, and then I want to get like my mount. And then I got to start learning how to craft some things and... Oh my god, you're dual wielding. 
You're dual wielding two staff? Wait, what? Get mount? Sure. Okay, don't laugh at me. One day that's gonna happen. I'm addicted to shi shinies are awesome. Shinies are big awesome. I mean... I also like shinies. <laughs> I need to level up Mesmer. This is so perfect for a Mesmer. Oh, it's a scepter and a torch. Okay. I just thought it looked so big. It looked like a staff almost. Gold digger confirms she likes shinies. Oh, <gasps> epic! <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Everyone is going necro. Why is that, Murray's? Or I heard that Reaper was getting a big buff next week, apparently, which is cool, because that's the elite spec that I want to try out. Hmm. Okay, anyway, so this was the pun guy. Let's try this again. <laughs> Watch for you step something's afoot. Hmm. The fort was abandoned so fast, the triad hardly had time to collect their notes. Vines were scattered all over. The place looked awful lot like what happened to Fort Salma and Concordia. Do you think Mordremoth has attacked or will attack this fort? Uh, I mean, there are vines, so there's definitely something going on here. <laughs> Ooh, look at all these cool abilities. Necro is getting buffs across the board except Scourge. Scourge is in a good spot. Well, uh, I like. I mean, I, I picked Necro as my, my first starting class or character, so... That sounds cool. That sounds very cool indeed. Discret? Discret? What? Discret like... Uh, discret like gold that much. Can I be like a little bit cuter than a scrit though, please? Sorry. I've been having to mute myself to like try to clear my throat. It's been a bit funky today. Shinies. <laughs> shinies. Yes. Give us more shinies. I like shinies. Yo, Karma. Who doesn't like the shinies? That guy looked at me funny, okay. Ah, there's tendril roots all over here. All right, EP and into the unknown. Skirts are actually very smart if they are in large number. Wait, th do they get an intelligence buff when they stack or what? <laughs> oh, this is somewhere new that I've not been before. Oh, I am so losing blood to my hand. This cat, you are so amazing, but you are also so, um. You are, you are so... You, you're a little bit heavy there. <laughs> Just looking at me like, what do you mean? You're heavy. Hmm. Hmm. Azora actually worry of scrits and high numbers. Oh my goodness. Okay. We made it to a new place. The Silver Waste. Would you like to continue your story if you needed the pack? Yes. Ooh, ships. They look like fishies. Or dragonfly fishies. Alright, we got 12 minutes left on uh, the first giveaway. Find a place to lay those maps <gasps> Get her, and it's my favorite, least favorite salad dude. You already did the dry top map, right? Yeah, I did. That was the first uh, first couple of chapters of Living World Season 2. In dry top. It was very different from wet top. Okay, I don't know where I was going with that. <laughs> Reaper was at his best back in the day when we had the meme build Reaper Healer. That sounds OP as heck, considering that you guys have said that Reaper is supposed to be like the pure damage um, 
like for damage spec. Yes, sir. You can't you can't pair up big damages with with heals. <laughs> Three harder is the most annoying sound of everything. I blame Traherne for what happened to Tybalt in the base expansion with Saiten, so yeah. He's my bunny. My bunny. What? What and none of the others know where that oh yeah Ritlock uh, got sucked into a different dimension mm, i forgot about that i was like yo Ritlock this does he's not currently available so I'm glad you're with us. you can blame who you want we will all remember how it went who closed the gate in my defense i didn't realize that tipple was gonna run in there and try to play hero okay I was distraught. I was I was absolutely horrified. <laughs> Yo, what's up, dude? Thank you for coming at such short notice. I thought you might be busy with post summit summit summit. I can't talk today. Diplomatic concerns. Right now, fact is high in my priority list. I'm glad. This staging base is our launch point for an early attack on Mordermoth. Before the dragon gets too strong. That's smart. Exactly. We're fortifying as quickly as we, as we can. We believe Mordormoth is west of here. Or south, perhaps. This jungle seems to be spreading eastward. I have a mission. I have a squad missing. What? There's a missing squad? They were on a scouting mission, and they should have been back last night, but they didn't return. There were two non-pack with them. Oh, you sent civilians in a squad? Our friend Kay, then a diplomat sent here by the Crichton government to investigate the situation. His name is... Kanash? Well, like, like, Kanash? But Kanash... Both are very capable, but may be outnumbered. We need to look for them and see if they need reinforcements. Would you be willing to lead the mission? I got this. I am Superman. music is giving me star wars vibes really well yeah, maybe during the core game it's a full assault and tree herders like mander we need to talk <laughs> like we don't have time to talk oh yeah he's uh he's he's special special yo abraham hey i saw you meeting with your heard what he wants <laughs> You have, uh, you have to do things with the pact. Marshall, uh, excuse you, Marshall Gerard is requesting my help to find a missing squad. You're the perfect choice for that. You already have a lot of experience with Mordrum. You gonna be in charge or something? <laughs> yes, he's putting me in charge of a squad. I'd offer to come. I've got to make sure. Hmm. Time he's safe. She's looking for the packed engineer to toughen Scruffy's armor. I'll never forget how close she came to dying in that inquest attack. <gasps> Thick Scruffy, buff Scruffy. We love Scruffy, but he was scrappy technically for a little while. I'll keep an eye on the squirt. You're gonna be okay, right? Ah, poor self. Fine. Ugh. Yeah, unga bunga. Hey, he's, uh, he's, uh, he's, he's a decent guy. We will leave him all. <laughs> oh my god, cat. How long can I keep you here? Ugh. Look. He's on my arm. Oh my god, thank you. Oh. Oh, freedom. Freedom. Ah. Oh. I was severely losing blood and my capabilities of playing the game. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yes, you're a good boy. You're such a good boy. We are progressing through the story, Nils. In a... <laughs> in a somewhat timely fashion. Oh, numb with loves. Yeah, really. Really numbs. Extra nummies. 
Hmm. Okay. Where's Where's Timey? <gasps> Whoa! Wait, I have no idea if Scruffy looks. Does Scruffy look different? Is he glowing more? Actually, everyone looks like they're glowing. Why is everyone glowing here? Why am I glowing so much here? Why are we glowing? You never did anything to hurt him, did you? Of course not. We welcomed him into our fold, but he grew violent. It started with episodes of confusion and aggression. We just decided. Uh, a 45 minute store break? Uh, I blame the cat. Excuse me. Excuse me. No, wait. Why do we need to go up alone? Moonlight? We believe he's still searching for a place where. Oh. <laughs> Is it? Is it the moon that's making everything glowy? I mean, that's pretty cool. If it is the moon. Okay, I wasn't paying attention to what was going on with the time, you know. I don't think she's very happy. Ooh, Master of Lightning. Uh, pardon me, miss. I'm told by this delightful young miss here that you saved the life of our Master of Peace. Seems you have a knack for commanding the aspects. Mm. Aaron was out of control. He had to be stopped. I'm Val, <laughs> by the way. I'm Val. Hi, how are you? How did the Master of Peace look when you saw him last? Was he injured at all? No, nope, apparently not. He's determined. And of course, the best among us. Any of us could survive out there. If any of us could survive out there on our own, it would be him. Nevertheless, you're risking your own lives to try and catch up with him? We fear the day will come when he will need us. And we want to be there when it does. I won't keep you any longer. Bye-bye. <laughs> I want to talk to Scrubby in, in, in time here. Hmm. Oh, Booba's biggest hurt. Whoa, 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 whoa. We, 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 we're not comparing like that. We're not comparing like that, Frogman. <laughs> That's not how we do things here. But maybe. Maybe indeed. You look so serious. Doya wears a similar face sometimes. When her experiments are especially dangerous. What are you gonna do? Oh, sorry, Cap. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna go find Cave and Kenash. Raham's going to take you home. Out! Means the wastes? Perhaps I should go with you. What if something happens to you? I'm meeting up with and leading a pack squad. I will not be alone. I can find my engineer and get home alone. You don't need to watch over me every second. Seriously. I am not a baby. You two will be safer together. Don't worry about me. I'll see you later. I mean, she's not a baby, but she's a kid. We gotta take care of her, right? We had to take care of her. Yeah, we got two and a half minutes left uh, for the first giveaway. Exclamation mark gems. Uh, to win a item of your choice from the shop. Worth up to 650 gems. I will gift you. Alright. Alright. We did it. You guys are right. These chapters were actually really short. <laughs> you can only enter one time. <laughs> Hi, Gladden. Gladden, thank you for gifting Syntex a sub when I was, uh, when I was offline. Thank you. Happy Sunday. Mm, oh my god, my throat is being so annoying today. Jaime is like 13 and Braham is si Wait, he is only like 16 or 17? <laughs> and I'm trusting him to, to babysit her? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> it's messed up. Not apparently. All right. Advanced gardening? 
Since our rediscovery of the Silver Waste, the Society has been interested in studying the unique physiology of its hardest flora. I sent you an extraction tool that makes the removal of flora organs easier. We're willing to trade your we're willing to trade you bandit crests in exchange for these mordrum um plant parts. The fragile nature of flora organ means only the toughest specimens yield valuable samples. Valuable samples. So the plants must be of considerable strength and stature. I heard there's an underground chamber filled with such creatures in the silver wastes. Use the extraction device I sent you when you're ready to fight one. And bring me the parts you extract. Happy harvesting! The Silver Wastes Crypto Botanical Society. <laughs> Alright. Um. Cool. I got a thing. I got a thing. Oh! I was so busy. <laughs> I was so busy reading that. I didn't even do a countdown. I'm such a terrible streamer. <laughs> Yo! Congratulations, Fallon! On winning the first giveaway of the day. Let me know if you're here. Um, we'll, we'll give Fallon, uh, we'll give Fallon uh, a bit. There's no need to stress. Oh, there you are. Perfect. All right. So let me know what your in-game name is so I can add you. And then whenever you know what item you want me to gift you, uh, up to 650 gems, let me know what it is. You can uh, write in the Guild Wars chat in Discord if you need time to browse. Um, or you can just let me know in chat here. Hello, Lees. What's up? Well, yes, or here as well. I just meant like if if you know they don't know what they want and they wanted to sit and figure it out for a while. But uh, yeah, yeah, I'll need a sec to expect to win. Yeah, but no worries. Like I said, take your time. Um. And if you still haven't figured it out by the time I end stream, uh, you can just pop into Discord and let us know in the Guild Wars uh, channel. No rush. We don't stress things here. Okay, how do I add someone to this game? <laughs> Yo! There we go. Oh, cool. I need Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Like, imagine Sonic in the 100 meter race. That would be very cool. That would be very cool indeed. Yeah, but we was rigged. Well, there will be another one in a little bit. Um, but I think I deserve a cookie. I think I deserve a cookie. Okay. Catch up with Kate. Kate's? Katie's? I think you guys like tore me a new one for how I was pronouncing her name before. But I'm gonna find my squad. Paladina. <gasps> Have you tried this flavor? I don't know how new it is, but it's not a traditional one. Salt and vanilla. Honestly, this is basically their version of an Oreo cookie. That's exactly what this reminds me of. But I think it's really good. <laughs> I think these are better than Oreos. Um, but yeah, it's basically it's basically or Oreo cookie. Any wowzers in the upcoming hour as well? Um, maybe. We'll see. I haven't really decided what today looks like. You can ignore as much as you want, but I was promised adventures in Atheros in the announcement of Wednesday. <laughs> yes, that is true. I, that is true. I did say that. 
Um, but yeah, I I don't I don't I don't know. <laughs> I'm not saying it was a lie. I always have great plans. We shall see. I'm currently very much into this story at the moment. Hello, Vrenis. Yes, I am doing Living World Season 2. Um, I'm trying to do all of this story in, in like, the correct order. And, yeah, I'm basically halfway through. I'm on uh, Chapter 5. You're also newish, just finishes this week. No! Welcome! You're probably newer than me and further ahead. <clears throat> Saying something and not doing it is pretty much a lie. No. I mean... It, it depends on very much the context, I think. I would never, um... I would never, like, pinky promise something and then break it intentionally. But, um... Yeah. I feel like I'm kind of okay with WoW for now until the the next patch comes on. Another thing I need to do, which thank you for reminding me and thank you for getting short rats to remind me as well, was uh, that I completely forgot about the uh, trading post. Or... I didn't forget, I more like didn't realize that there was only one week left of April, uh, because this month has been going so fast. And like crazy at work and everything. But thank you for lurking. And uh thank you for the follow of Redis. You did like for three months. Natalie's gonna give me so much crap right now. I've had this game for eight months. I have 140 hours of playtime. How much playtime do you have? I gave up about five months ago. Uh, yeah. You're not sure how to log in and check, all right. Yeah, if you're not sure how to do that, you just slash age him in chat. I had this discussion, I think, last weekend, and like some people had like thousands and thousands of hours, and I was just like, oh, oh my god. <laughs> Hello again, shorts. What up? 1.8k hours, new bear. See, that also makes me like terrified because you call yourself a noob at 1.8k hours and at the same time i know i've also been told that i haven't even scratched the surface of what is guild wars i feel like i'm doing my um, you know <laughs> just i'm just doing one step at a time i guess it would be nice to reach a point where i kind of understand the game more if that makes sense like in wow i know kind of like what kind of things i can do you know like if we're like okay it's time to farm mounts i know that whole rotation like where we're going how we get there like i want to start doing meta trains at some point but i have no idea what they like where everything is i don't know how the events work i don't even know like what did i don't know i just don't know <gasps> is this an elevator oh my god it's an elevator or it, it's not an elevator it's a gateway but the gate is open but it's amazing anyway <laughs> i love the water elevator things uh oh um there's a really big guy where i need to go Okay, and apparently they're taking him on, so I gotta help. It wasn't that big of a guy, apparently. It was a smaller guy. I just wanted to help clear the threat. Yoo-hoo! I'm playing a necromancer. Uh, I'm a Norn. The very Viking-y, Norse mythology-inspired Norn race. 
and then uh necromancer hmm Hi, I'm new here. I joined stream and we're talking about playtime. I'm scared to check. <laughs> Why are you scared to check, Marnie? Do it. Have you played for a really long time? <laughs> yes, thank you for lurking. Uh, I'm currently brushing my dog. <laughs> she sheds so much I have to brush her once a week. Oh, I need to get better at brushing my cats. Not because they shed a lot while well, they do their cats. Um... But they just love they love it especially lumi she loves when i take out the the brush oh you're a savari necromancer let's go i heard we're getting some nice buffs next week yeah apparently by the way have you heard about the rings of power lawsuit it seems amazon allegedly stole the story from an unreleased manuscript from one dude wait what no what is going on i have 704 hours over 10 years it seems healthy <laughs> i don't know that's like sparsely played over the last 10 like it may be you've taken bigger breaks friend i was gonna say i was like mickey mickey mosh who i got to start playing this game where i started playing the game after i did he's already got like 700 hours or something <laughs> i was like whoa uh i just finished getting the reaper unlocked i've been messing with that yeah, yeah, yeah reaper apparently reaper is getting a buff i don't know so much more than what um chat's been telling me because uh, we were talking about that because i i could actually um i could actually unlock reaper i've just been a bit hesitant to do it because i'm just trying to like learn core necro and get a hang of that and then they were like oh but reaper's getting a big buff next week and i was like "Ooh, this is nice <laughs> this location has a meta called fry buff funny thing it means fish <laughs> what you basically siege slash defend four outposts red yellow blue and amber and you have to push through a, you have to push into a cave through three tunnels at the same time to fight a big a big bad flower flower so metas are like events that you can find on different maps and then people just like go around and just like do all of them or as many as they can or whatever cool yeah i would like to learn more about meta trains later i think it would be cool if we um i was gonna say if we could do meta trains together no but like if you guys can carry me through meta trains <laughs> how about that all right what is this corpse it appears to be wired to some kind of device. Yo, we found the Silvari! It's rigged to explode. Oh, apparently Unless it's rigged to explode. Oh. A fine mist, I advise you to step away. Thank you for saving my butt. Thank you for saving my butt. Okay, where 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 did this go? Oh <gasps> Marnie! You have twelve thousand hours yo i think that's uh i think that's the largest uh that's the most amount of hours i think i've seen in chat anyway yo beset hello what's up welcome back insane I've been playing since the Guild Wars 2 betas. What was what was Guild Wars 2 released? 2014? How long has it been out? A little over 10? Is it? Give me a sell. Oh, now Tuna's gonna be like... Oh, 2012. Okay, sorry. But yeah, so over a decade anyway. That's what I meant. I, I, said, I like how I said 2014. It was like a little over 10 years. I can't math. I know it's been out for a little over 10 years. <laughs> Still, that's impressive. 
that's like what almost a thousand hours a year that's a part-time job isn't a full-time job two thousand hours like ish like really rough around the edges here <laughs> i love 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 yo yes i can what is that called in uh Sorry, no results found because I can't spell. Can. Can. Da 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 da. This Mound Adoption License? Now I want to see. I want to see what these look. Ooh. Oh, which one are you going to get? Oh my goodness. Oh, wait, wait, let me guess. Let me guess. Let me guess. You don't have a sky scale yet. Maybe. Otherwise, you should totally get this one. Oh, you're getting this one. Oh my God. Or this one. Are you getting one of the griffins? Oh, you get a random one. Oh, okay. 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 I didn't know that. It's random, but you're hoping for the griffin. That means, that means I get points. I get points. I knew it. I knew that was the one you were hoping for. <laughs> okay. Um. <clears throat> cool. Nope. Wasn't it like... Oh my god. Wait, do you have to add me back? What is your name? Where are you? There you are. Untart. Yeah, exactly. Da, 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 da. Why are there so many people here that aren't even in my friends list? Maybe they are. Where did you go? Where? Where? Da, 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 Wait a second. Why are you not in my friends list? Do, 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 do. do you want to add me as well? Have you added me? Oh. All friends. <laughs> so you need to be friends for some time? What? How long do we have to be friends? How long do we have to be friends for me to gift stuff? This is bogus. How long? To be fair, it's like it was always like this. I know it's like this on Steam. On Steam, I always had to wait three days to be able to gift someone after a giveaway. You might have to be a little bit patient. You have to add them to... No, I added first. I... 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 They are added. Very much added. Hi, Max. Thank you for the follow. Welcome. Let me see if Google wants to tell me how long we have to wait. Um. Hmm. Check for arena that night. No, I, I, I am. I'm checking for both names. They're not. Hmm. Not, not here. None of them. Ah, hmm. uh, I'm you. But that shouldn't matter for um. For gifting. Is it case sensitive? But it's an order of the alphabet. So it should be right here. And it's not. Do, 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 unless it's 
No. Hmm. Okay. Um. What else? Just to be sure you have the expansions both. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Oh, that that is <laughs> that is an old giveaway thing. Whoops. Yeah, there will be another giveaway for gyms shortly. I just want to sort this giveaway out to see. This track place. That's an old giveaway that I did before. That's World of Warcraft. <laughs> um I just didn't realize that there was a command for that. There'll be another giveaway for uh 650 gems. Maybe copy the name from a whisper message? Huh? So weird. Maybe like it hasn't registered that I wait, am I in an instance? Oh no, I'm in an instance. I also just started this instance, so it's not like it matters. I was thinking maybe like if I restart the game it'll take up that I got a new friend. <laughs> Hello Neos! Uh, welcome, how are you? Does Fallen have all the Guild Wars 2 expansions? Uh yes. Yes. Said that uh at least Alan said yes. I'm gonna I'm gonna try um I'm just gonna like try going back. The instance might be the issue, maybe. Okay, I'll leave. We just started that instance anyway, so we can just reset, it's fine. Da 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 Let's see. Hmm. Who's got my back? It absolutely. Oh, 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 wait, that's you? Right? Okay. Here we go. This is right. We got it to work. Cool. There we go. I hope you got it. <laughs> yeah. I think... Oh, I tried the character name in the instance as well. So I think it was... Uh, I was a, like... A combination of both, maybe. I don't know. Whatever. We solved the problem. Thanks for the help, guys. Uh, apparently it's character name if they're online, account name if they're not. Yeah, that's actually really weird. Awesome! <gasps> the Murlocs didn't work? I know why, because I had to restart my computer, that's why. I'm so sorry. I have some Murlocs on me. Hello, Siento. Welcome back. I hope you had a lovely weekend. Now you have to tell us which one you get when you open it. Fingers crossed you get the griffin um, or something that you think is cute anyway. Oh, you got the Mishiva's Bullfight skin if you're wondering. Sorry, I didn't even see. Uh oh, why am I under attack? Get me in this instance. That's an amazing skin. Now I need to see what the skin looks like because I don't remember which one's which. <laughs> I'm sorry you didn't get the one you wanted. I hope you like that one. Congratulations. Um. Vulpin, that sounds like a jack. Oh, oh my goodness. Yeah, I picked that license because I love the most. I wouldn't be sad. <laughs> this one's nice. That's a really, really nice jackal skin. All right, well, congratulations. Awesome. 
Awesome sauce. Also glad we got that sorted out. I got really worried there for a second. I was like, oh, what am I doing wrong? Why can't they give people? Cool. Then uh, let's set up another one. And uh, let's let's uh, get the, the ball rolling. Do 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 Okie dokie. Let's do this. Have the fire maps are awesome. Well, I still have a way to go. I'm going to wrap up Living World Season 2 first. Okay, so... um, Yeah. There's another one open. Exclamation mark gems. Oh, we go. This time I'm not gonna get blown up by this thing because I know that it's uh that it's a bomb. Thanks for warning Not me again, though. It's weak to explode unless you wish to be vaporized into a fine mist. How the fire maps were different because they were specifically designed for mounts. It'll be interesting to see. One thing that's also annoying is that you cannot right-click the level rewards. We go so much faster when making a new tune. Oh, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't made a new tune yet. <laughs> I just stepped my one neck, bro. We'll see. I'll get there one day. Just hopping onto my PC. How do I check game time again? Right, so you just uh, type slash age in the chat box. Are you in the giveaway? If you're unsure if you're in the giveaway or not, you can just type exclamation mark gems uh, again, and then the bot will will tell you if you're already in because you're only able to claim one ticket but yes you are in Nils hello dude you're welcome forgive me you're welcome commander oh let's call me commander <laughs> spare me the sarcasm just show me which way game is headed <laughs> he doesn't like me as you wish Along the way, I advise bringing these mines to any more drip corpses we come across. Hi, right, let's get going. Wait, why do we hate each other? Uh... Hmm. Okay. Making new tune. Have to do first story instance. Then go bank. Grab 78 tomes of knowledge. Then go to quiet place and get ready to abuse your mouse <laughs> level one by one. Oh. So you can't just like use all. That's actually really weird. Despite bold here, if we're slack, we can bypass them. That is very weird. Considering that you can do that with everything else. I'm a clicker though. I like to open my loot boxes individually. I used to get yelled at for that. We're like, foul, just open all at the same time. <laughs> and I'm like, no. <laughs> I had saved up so many candy cane like loot boxes during the Halloween event. And uh, I was going to have, you know, the satisfying job of opening or clicking them one by one. And everyone was just like, foul, please, please, please just, just open all. Just open all of them. <laughs> I ended up giving into group pressure. Oh no, there's a dead body here. With fresh wounds. That's not good. Yo, get him. Oh, sad. 
Yes, hello, welcome back. How are you? Okay. You have 350 hours played, Abrenis. That's, uh... That is a lot more than I have. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well done. You're a veteran of this game now, compared to me, anyway. <laughs> you had like over 200 200 of the candy cane bags I was gonna open I was it would have been a glorious moment to just open them individually I would have been so excited I think I I just ended up dividing the stack instead so I think I opened like 80 of them at once and then like 50 50 so maybe a hundred be fair, I've also been AFK in the game a lot. I'm AFK looking at all the cute, cool fashion, fashion things. Oh my god, more plants. Yoo-hoo! Easy. That was also not the way. Whoa, 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 there's more plants. Where the heck did you come from? These wolves are aggressive. Very, very aggressive. If they included the Southstone arc in the remade Living World Season 1, then you would have been the one to originally arrest him because he did a very anti-hero thing. Oh, so we have history that I don't know about. That makes so much more sense, because I was like, whoa, off the bat, so salty. You will suit me, my people in the game in the next zone. <gasps> your people! I'm very excited to meet your people. I wasn't paying attention. Oh my god. It'll be an honor. It'll be an honor, Pokemon. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. I hope you're having a wonderful weekend. Uh oh no 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 i healed myself this is bs actual BS. actual yes god we have to run all the way back oh my god hmm f1 is usually the lies my shroud. i'm gonna miss shroud i'm gonna miss my shroud For sure. So who are your people, Frogman? I feel like I've met most of the, uh... Most of the, the, the races. And I've been to Divinity's Reach, I've been to the Grove, obviously Norn. I've been to the Black Citadel. Have I been to the Asuran capital? Is that the cube? No, Ratha Sum. Stop calling it the Borg Cube. Oh, the frog people. Ah, <laughs> uh, of course, of course. How did I not see that myself? I apologize for not making that connection straight away. That was absolutely terrible of me. Silly Val. Silly, silly, silly bow. Uh oh. That's another body. We'll save you. Oh, okay. I saved you. Okay. <gasps> okay. What's up? This one salad person not trying to kill us and take over the world. Oh, wait. I missed loot. <gasps> Use open lost banner chests in the silver waste. Okay. I can find chests. I have keys. Very good. They make funny sounds. Welcome to the Silver Wastes. I see you have my little brother. Oh, wait, they're siblings? You need some help? Nothing I couldn't handle, though I do appreciate the sentiment. Oh, they do not want me here. Has your squad found anything useful? 
Not yet, though my instincts tell me we're close to finding the source of these Mordrum incursions. Judging from their increasing numbers, I'd say we must be I didn't realize they were siblings, though. If so, I imagine they will be increasingly belligerent. The silver race is so real fun. The action starts, also, of our siblings that came from one tree. Oh. Oh. But wait, how but how does that actually work? They sure do have similar roots. No, 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 but seriously though. Seriously. <laughs> Ser serious question. Serious question. But you see what mommy tree and daddy tree love each other very much. <laughs> no, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I know how that works. Okay, I know I know how that works. But what about I can understand like they came from the same tree or like whatever that stuff but like how does silvari actually mate because if you guys are gonna tell me that they grow from freaking pods or like seeds on the ground i'm a i'm a ult of four <laughs> i was wobbing silvari the 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 plant people in guild wars Oh my god, did they actually grow? Oh my god, the pale tree births them from pods when they are ready. Oh my... When a mommy Solvari and a daddy Solvari love each other very, very much. No, apparently they don't do that because they're just birds from pods. They grow like apples? <laughs> now great thanks thanks alex uh now i'm just picturing little little Savari like hanging from trees slowly growing not not in a cocoon or anything like that butterfly style like just literally just a body growing but does that mean they don't have like actual like but they don't have family or i mean like how does that work there's no mommy They're all just grown. Do they have a connection through the pale tree instead? So intriguing. Alright, I need to find some gold. Uh oh. Panic ensues. I need to get lip balm quickly. Finish this part of the story. You make a Silvari and play the first 15 minutes to find out at some point. Mm hmm that's fair that is that is uh that is that is that is fair <laughs> we're gonna have to do that i actually want to do the starting stories of all the races to get as much like info as possible um of this discussion <laughs> i feel lucky for the past hour or so this made me laugh <laughs> hello uh, <laughs> uh, I'm just like, where did they come from? Uh, <laughs> welcome. Thank you very much for the follow. Is it, is it Ayan or Ian? Nice to meet you. Are you, uh, are you also a Guild Wars streamer? Thank you for the welcome to Syria. Ian. All right. Thank you for the pronunciation help. I should try to remember that. Oh, oh my goodness. Nice. Look at the little Azora. Your emotes are really cute. Big, uh, big fan of the, the, the cat, the cat ears. Love the kitties. Hmm. I know the best guides in the game. <gasps> oh, you do guides. To be fair, I should actually try to to uh to to get into some guides and maybe watch some of that stuff to understand the game more. Because there's so much that I don't know. <laughs> I'm so new. 
Awesome. I'm definitely up for watching guides if they're like if I can find. I just need to figure out which guides I can watch that don't have spoilers. So maybe I should finish the story first. I'm not sure. I don't even watch guys Final Fantasy. Well, I will watch guides when I get back into Final Fantasy. Um, but right now I'm, I'm into Guild Wars. My vids are in case you get stuck. All right, cool. Well, now I know. Oh, I will definitely be sure to check them out if I do get stuck. Anybody who ever struggled with anything in this game has seen one of <laughs> I guys. Awesome. Well, thanks for popping in so that uh, I could receive this knowledge. And now I know where to turn to if I do get stuck on something, even though chat has been incredibly, incredibly helpful with uh, all kinds of questions that I have had on the way. Also, there are no Savari babies. Yeah, but I was thinking about that too, because I was just like, if they grow from pods, that means there's no mommy, daddy, like kids babies Savari children i don't know do they come out of their pods like premature back to the whole like where else where does Savari come from <laughs> i really wasn't ready for that i really wasn't ready for that i i actually thought that they um you know did, did, did it the traditional way so to speak but apparently not they actually grow from pods. Can you believe? My squad following me. Yeah, kind of. Can I just let that patrol sneak past? If you guys pull that back, you're on your own. Oh my god. No, they're not. I will, I will leave them. I will save them. Is my void cloud active? Oh, I did not mean to press that. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> Carl, please don't put me in the spices. I don't know. I don't know where I can open a tin of sewage jumping in a safe environment without making everyone mad at me. <laughs> I need to go out into nature somewhere. Nothing can bring me down. Uh oh. Right, we've got, we've got, we've got, we've got. They can get cheeky with it, but they're a first force from the pale tree and second force. <laughs> Jiggy, thank. Oh my goodness! All right, thanks for the new mental image. Lovely. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh. oh, the brow emote. Cherry. Cherry cherry on top. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm glad I'm glad to hear that they're not, you know, missing out on a a really big part of uh, at least what humans think is a really big part of life. It's good to know. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Operations for the local Mordrum. Do you see that glow? Yes. What could they be up to all the way out here? Oh my god. Inbound and should consider retreating. We are deep in their territory and we are vastly outnumbered. We should send up a flare. I hope the pact will see our signal and send help. Yes, reinforcements, right? You guys aren't sending me to deal with that by myself. Because that's going to take a really long time. That was a really big plant. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, your favorite Swedish streamer got banned. Hello, McGroin. Welcome back. Who got banned? Hmm. I'm sorry, someone that you enjoyed. Uh... I know Foshin. Was it Foshin? 
Hello, whatever you guys call him in the... What did he, uh, what did he do to get banned? Hello, NZ. How are you doing? Happy Sunday. There's some lore about Savari that came out of a pod not by the Pale Tree, but I gotta look that up to no more. Ooh, so somewhere there's a pod of Savari not from the Pale Tree. Maybe the Pale Tree. Okay, I'm gonna stop trying to make really bad mommy and daddy jokes. <laughs> Southern Abyss, welcome. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> <gasps> there's an evil there's a pale tree and a shadow tree they're forever they're forever setting the balance between good and evil in interior <laughs> I, I don't know for some reason i feel like guild wars 2 lore is harder to get into compared to wow how come how, how do you tell me why like, i love wow lore but i in general like i'm a lore geek in in any game that i like get invested to when i say lore geek i mean that i'm interested in learning and i like reading about it but i'm really bad at retaining information and remembering it though so i've read so much about wow lore but i couldn't recite too much i'm really bad at remembering names and things like that like names and, and dates times stuff like that you know who varian is well you know what he's dead so he doesn't matter anymore. Golden boy is taking over. Um, yeah. Congratulations, you know more than I remember that clip. I've seen that clip. It's like very. <laughs> yeah, but she doesn't care about Lord that way. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, but uh, but I enjoy reading. I enjoy reading about lore anyway. I have a bunch of like wow books and stuff and and if if uh if guild wars lore turns out to be as intriguing like i don't know how deep it is like how far back it goes or that way i don't know if there's if there's books written about it or whatever but i would potentially be interested in, in learning more through like reading i have the 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 warcraft chronicles which i love they start at the beginning of like everything and they go through like all the history even if wow lore can be very contradicting and very mazy at times i watch some videos and stuff about guild wars 2 but i can't seem to get attached to it no idea why though <laughs> that's fair i mean if you're really invested into wow lore or something else then maybe you just don't think it's like as good or as captivating alex thank you for the follow by the way how to see what's going on what is this that flare attracted more oh that's our flare we have to relocate we're boxed in up here. Survive the Mordrum assault. Oh, we're about to get we're about to get owned. Unleashing the Lich form. Varian was a wise king. I can't believe Legion killed two fan favorite characters. So we had to give we had to give room. We had to give room for Anduin. And a little the lion cub had to grow up grow up. I know, I think it's refreshing that they kill off characters sometimes, but I also understand as like a gaming, you know, it's a game and the whole franchise, like you have to be careful with who you kill off. <laughs> Why couldn't we kill Anduin instead of Varian? Mm, uh, I don't like Anduin. Why don't you like Anduin? Do you guys think he's too much of a puppy? Why did you just kill Thrall? Why not just get rid of all of them? Would you guys have actually been upset if they killed Sylvanas though? What about that whole shit show of a story arc? We can't kill Grieve Jesus. Oh. Carl's like, excuse me. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Don't worry, Carl. He's safe for now. I am death He's safe for now. Meanwhile, these Mordrum husks are not safe because I'm about to whoop some ass. What if they killed Savannah so wait? I mean, she's stuck in the 
fucking realm of the dead she'll be back though they they put her in there because they want to they want to bring her back out later for sure I expect them to kill Savannah Spiona so they play Forsaken. Okay, I need some healies. While standing in bad stuff. Oh, yes! Roll, roll out of one thing into the other. Good job there, Val. Where are reinforcements? What are you telling me? Oh, nice. It was not important. Letting me know my bills have been paid on time. That's nice. I mean, it's good that my bills are being paid on time. But I don't want to be reminded that I had to pay bills. Uh, it's always work this, work that. What about Murlocs? <laughs> when is their time to shine? <laughs> I'm definitely on Team Murloc. 100%. What are you guys doing all the way down there? Like, come on. No. Well, this is in the state of in case of emergency. <laughs> That's basically. It's like, oh, no, we need a story arc. Okay, break the glass. Bring Savonis back. She escaped somehow. Or fulfilled her purpose. Uh oh. Um, This is our backup, right? Why, why does it look why does it look so ominous oh my god where's that i'm trying to how do i get on the chopper oh there we go <laughs> get on the chopper you and the commander have experience hmm. with dragons is this predictable behavior elder dragons are far from predictable they're, they're minions a sort of situational awareness it's a it's a uh, it's very thorny over here for sure. I need a Murloc expansion with a Murloc player. <laughs> It'd be awesome. I'd also want to run around like a Murloc for a little bit. I, I wouldn't run around as a Murloc permanently though. I don't think I'd like main a Murloc. Because I really like my space coat. And I feel like a Murloc wouldn't look very great in a lot of transmog either. And I like looking cool in transmog. But it would definitely be cool to run around like a Murloc. Friendly reminder to clean your gamer desk. Stay clean. <laughs> yes, thank you. We were talking about this like last stream. Like how often do you actually clean your keyboard properly? Like take off all the keycap <laughs> and stuff. <gasps> the quest line in Dragonfly was awesome. Yes, the Murloc. Uh, the Murloc quest line. You must have enjoyed that, Frogman. <laughs> Murloc makeup first. Hello, Arathir. What's up, Gildy? I mean, I'm a half a Murloc in main life. In in main life, in real life. So, yeah. All right. We uh we did it. By we did it, I got out of there safely. This message must be of some importance. Bring it to a shining bladed officer in Divinity's Re- Okay. Apparently. Ooh, a bandit short bow. And an embroidered coin purse that also had more loot. This whole, like, my loot boxes have loot boxes is just never gonna get old. Never. It's just too good. Bags of stolen goods. Oh my goodness. Uh, more loot bags. I'm gonna clean my bags. I'm like, I, I try so hard to keep my bags clean. And there's just more and more stuff filling my bags up. I need to find a merchant. The sun in my face. <laughs> usually like the thing is like we have windows on both sides of the house so i wake up with the sun in the bedroom in the mornings and it's really nice like during the summers anyway and then it moves on and enters like the kitchen and the living room throughout the evening so i have sun all around 
like morning day and evening and it is actually really nice but yes when i'm sitting here and i have some like if it, if you ever watch like one of the long streams i do i'll always start with like the sun will be here and then it will slowly move across my face as we progress throughout the day and then now it's almost gone it's so close behind the curtain i like maybe another 20 minutes and it will be gone half an hour Frita. be lovely <gasps> maybe i'll start the new trends it will just be like it will just be like the, the dotted line dotted line of tan tan tanness Skeleton. <laughs> oh, fox smacking up. Good shit. Okay, wait. I don't even know where I'm going, except for there's a really big guy here. Oh, I thought I saw a merchant. Oh, that was up. There's a merchant up. Nice. I'm gonna clear my bags. Will they let me back in? Yes. Thank you. Clearly jumped that, but whatever. Hello there, Mr. Uh, Mr. Merchant. He's Scott Merchant. You like to buy some junk? Oh, nice. That's all I needed. Got rid of very much there. Hmm, but yeah. I know. I always feel extra cool when I just have like one line of uh of sun across my face. Makes me feel very pog. All right, I got a, I got a letter. I got a letter from Marjorie. We've hit a dead end here at the German Priory. We'd like to interview the resident dragon expert. He has retreated to a secure location deep within the Priory. Unfortunately, they changed the access cipher to that room on a regular basis and no one here knows the latest one. What? <laughs> they don't even know how to access all their rooms. Good job, guys. Remember that young explorer named Campbell from Fort Salma? Magister McKay believes she has the current cipher, and she's doing field work in the Silver Waste. Would you look into retrieving the cipher for us? You convince her to give you the cipher, repeat this phrase. Long live the King of Beldrevor. I should probably I could probably do that. Doesn't seem uh doesn't seem like rocket science, does it? Merchant is a popular name in the game. Maybe I'll be my next character there. <laughs> oh. Uh. Do not have Gardine. What? I have I have curtains. Yeah, but I don't want to draw them because I would like some daylight as well. It's just like when the sun hits the spots between the blinds hence like the dots but now it's gone now i now the sun's almost almost gone yes we have a rolling giveaway for uh an item of your choice that i will gift you for a worth of up to 650 gems information mark gems to join now it's cloudy no it's not cloudy the sun's just gone oh Oh, I'm supposed to go here. Okay. I thought maybe I was going to teleport somewhere else. The crow! Oh, they look very, very ferocious, these Blood Legion. Look at the derpy little helmets. You look like a rhino, dude. You look like a rhino. Whoa. Their choppers are really freaking scary. Really scary. Oh, hello there. Can I, can I also talk to Tactician? Tactician Envolt? <laughs> Frogman Young Sanders Core gifted a tier of one Yo. sub to Iron Maiden. They have given nine gift subs in the channel. Thank you. Thank you, Frogman. Thanks for giving Ian a sub. I'm welcoming her to the boop squad. You have been very, very, very kind today. Thank you. the boop boopity doop
Wait, imposter detected? What do you mean? Oh. Mimron. <laughs> Yo. Have you enjoyed the emotes? Thank you again, Frogman. Uh oh. Okay, who am I talking to? An Azuran. Came just as soon as we saw your flare, Commander. Took a big risk taking out one of our birds. How with all of this dust and sand in the air, but obviously one that was well justified. I appreciate that, Tactician. You know where Cave and Kanash went? I'm not sure about Kanash, but Cave went to report to the Marshal with information that you uncovered the enemy's disposition and behavior. The intel will be crucial to our strategic Frogman planning. Frogman underscore gifts in tier <laughs> one sub to heavy IQ. They have given 10 gift subs in the channel. <laughs> oh, Frogman, thank you for gifting heavy a sub as well. Thank you. And folks are welcome on it. Thank you for the follow. That is super sweet of you. Very, very kind. Um, anything else I can do for you? Actually, yes, I'm looking for an explorer in the name of Campbell. Ah, yes. He arrived shortly before you did. Out of an excavation in the field, I believe. I can mark your dig site for you on the map. Okay. Oh, that was the end of the chapter. Pita. Oh, shit. <laughs> Air me like that. <laughs> Jump scares are forbidden. <laughs> what? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, holy crap. <laughs> Thank you so much, Frogman. Bye. Okay, this this clearly warrants another sticky. If you want another sticky. <gasps> you got Kisora and Majestic. Oh my goodness. You got a breath here as well. <gasps> and free funware. That's a name I recognize. Be fun where it's been here and chatted with us for a little bit. Thank you kindly. I'm very grateful. Very, very, very nice. V very nice, very nice. I was going to say, <laughs> I was like, it was a well targeted gift bomb. He's a moon mod and he's everywhere too. I like. I think it's really sweet. The uh, the crisscrosses and like the different communities. I am captain now. <gasps> Frogman stole Gladys' spot on the pedestal. <laughs> Thank you kindly. Let me know if you want another sticky. No, they're not as cute as they were before. I need to get more cute ones. More cute ones for sure. Uh, he marked out her dig site. Oh, okay. Never mind that dig site. Yeah. Whoa, stop arguing, guys. That was such a blunder. Are you just trying to use... Anna's emotes as much as possible. <laughs> you're, welcome, you're welcome to use them. Yo! Hi, Funware! Welcome back. Welcome to the boop squad. Have a boop. Everyone gets a boop. Boops are, boops are given around here. Have you had a lovely weekend? Da 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 da. Gonna make some coffee. You know, man, we're talking about boops. Yes, you have been booped. You knew exactly what we were talking about. Cheeky. Cheeky, cheeky, cheeky. Wait, Anna's mom is the second best chess player in all of Sweden. Runs in the family, then. That's pretty poor. Howdy. My mind be squeaky clean? <laughs> Wait, what? Uh oh. Oh, there's a veteran here. 
I don't like those leeching thrashers. They're evil. I also went the long way around for some reason. Hmm. Yo. Your mind shouldn't be squeaky clean. Your mind should be, uh... To be fair, it should be squeaky clean. We we have we run a cleaky clean uh cleaky cleaky squeak. I can't talk anymore. A squeaky clean stream and community here. Obviously, nothing sus or you know no no innuendos or anything like that. I expect you guys to behave. I may or may not have played many hundreds of chess matches this past month. I'm still no good at it. <laughs> I used to play chess when I was like in school, like way back. 10, 11, 12, 13. Um, that, that way back. I came, I came third place in a tournament that we had like just for the school. So it was only like a few, you know, how many kids were we? Three, 400, I'm not sure how many of those participated, but quite a few. I came third in that tournament, and the person that came, the person that came first was one of my classmates at the time. That was like one of the best chess players um, in Sweden, like for his age. And the person that came second was his little sister. That's also really good at chess. Like their whole family uh, are really good chess players and compete like seriously. <laughs> so they came first and second. It wasn't much contest there. <laughs> I came third. <laughs> uh, how come you decided to get into chess? Like spontaneously or recently? <clears throat> oh, we found Explorer Campbell. I was told you had a certain priory cipher. Oh, the cipher to the storage room. I guess I'm the only one besides Magister Stonehealer who knows that. They're also scattered these days. Far too busy. Do you have the password? I do have the password. I do have it. I don't I don't play koi games, so very direct. Long live the king of Deldramore. That's it, you got it, huh? <laughs> Whatever. She just said she was laughing. <laughs> okay, read me the written copy. Am I supposed to remember this for later? Might need help. An almost king fathered a ghost. What? An almost king fathered a ghost. Hoofbeats drum at a trading post. And once a year upon an open stage, an eager kid comes of age. There are two or more lines, but I don't carry them with me. Well, where do I get the other two lines then? I left the other half behind for security reasons. You'll find it when you find the three books, each of the lines the cipher refers to. Oh, great. Each of the lines of the poem is a clue to a book in the special collections. You have to find them in order to touch them to activate their magic. Once you've found them in order, you're in. Can I, can't we just read it again? Okay, an almost king followed a ghost. A hoofbeat drum at a trading post. And once a year upon an open stage, an eager kid comes of age. All right, I got this. I got this. Easy. Hello, Pip Pip. <gasps> yes, dream hack. Dream hack, dream hack. 53 days. I love the countdown. Who else is going to dream hack summer? Guest, don't come in here and sass me. Don't come in here and sass me. We're PG, we're, we're, we're PG 12. We talked about this a lot. We don't say anything sus here ever. Definitely no evidence of my sussery, that's for sure. <laughs> well, yes, thank you for the follow. Welcome. Hope you're having a lovely weekend. I was taught chess by my dad when I was a kid. Never stopped playing it. Oh, okay. But you must be good at it then. I don't for a second believe that you're not good at it. Free funware. Just being modest. Okay. Uh, where are we going from here? We're going back to with the Priory. You cannot travel while in combat. Oh, I'm under attack. What? I too freaking...
freaking scorpion spiders. <laughs> Yo. Hi, Tuna. Defense, then offense. Thank you. The sneakies. Super sneaky. Trash collector. I've collected 32 out of 51 junk items, in case anyone wondered. I'm not going to dream hack, so I won't be able to say hi to Val. Go to DreamHack. DreamHack is fun. DreamHack is fun. It's a shame Val is not going to TwitchCon instead. I'm biding my time with TwitchCon. I'll, uh, I want to, I want to be able to, like, I want to be able to do everything that TwitchCon has to offer, which means that, like, wanting to go to twitchcon uh as as a twitch partner because there is like partner lounge thing and like partner party and stuff and i want to be able to network and do everything possible so i'm saving up for that then oh thank you so much for the prime thank you thank you volyx I hope you, uh, I hope you enjoy the emotes. What is it, Nils? Uh, but in case you don't care about emotes, have a boop. And my gratitude. Thank you. You have successfully entered the giveaway. I haven't has no clue what I'd be doing at TwitchCon, to be honest. That's kind of also... I don't know. Yeah. I think TwitchCon is, is cool if you know if you know people. So I'd want to know a few people before that I know are going. And then I'd also want to like maximize my experience uh, by being able to like attend everything. Um, so yeah, being partnered. I'd say this, if I was going to DreamHack, Val wouldn't go to DreamHack because she can't be in the same city as me for some weird ass reason. I would be going to DreamHack. It's part of my job to go to DreamHack, so I would. I told you, you should come to DreamHack. Did I go the wrong way again? No, I didn't. Nils, you want to show me something in game? Okay, I'm waiting. Teleport to, teleport to here. Teleport to here. Teleport to the, to the, to the Friary. <laughs> Val, would you come to TwitchCon if I told you I'd be going? Uh, <laughs> like I said, I, I don't want to go to... Like, even if I knew a bunch... Like, I, I already know so many people that are going. I know a bunch of streamers that are going. I, I, I So many people might be in an, uh, an over, over exaggeration. But I know people that are going. Um, but... Also, most of them are like partnered and they'll be doing like cool, cool partner things and be going to like all the cool parties and then I won't be able to go. So that's the reason why. Dream back in Melbourne. <gasps> I would love. Are you in Australia? Funware. I would love. I've been to Melbourne once. I've been to Sydney and I've been to Melbourne and I love both. And Australia is like one of the few places that I would consider actually moving to. Oh, not in Australia. <laughs> Why did you ask? Uh, but um, anyways, I was like, I would love to go to DreamHack in Australia regardless. Oh, that's the earliest DreamHack. Oh, okay, 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 I get, I get, I get. Um, yeah, they do dream hacks a little bit all over these days. I think their schedule is... Like, where's Nils? Nils, are you here? Oh, there you are! Oh my god, you look so cool. <gasps> what are all those cool animations? Very, very cool. Yeah, they're doing like Melbourne, Japan, uh, Dallas, Valencia... 
We're actually going to India this year as well. Um, and then Germany, and then a few other ones in the US, and then obviously the, the two in Sweden, which are DreamHack Summer and DreamHack Winter. Vindicator spec acquired. It looked very cool, Nils. So that's one of your elite specs, I guess. Hi, Ace. Welcome back. Good to see you again. I hope you've been well. <laughs> Guild Wars 2 Adventuring is, is going slow but steady. I'm um going through Living World Season Season 2 at the moment. Uh, and I'm probably nearing the end soon of uh, Chapter 5. So soon I can start Heart of Thorns, hopefully. Oh my goodness. Hello, filthy said. What's up? Am I coming to DreamHack in Germany? Um, a good question. I don't think this year, but potentially next year, I might be traveling to more DreamHacks. It's a little bit like, kind of depends on my job a little bit. Um, I'll definitely always be attending like the Swedish DreamHacks. And then we have to see like which ones around the world uh, they send me to as well. Oh, you're eating lunch. It's five o'clock. It's dinner time. Dinner time. <laughs> Patiently waiting for Diablo 4 to come out. Ooh. It's going to be so nice when that's out and I can play it from the couch. I, I'm I, I'm considering getting it like for the PlayStation, to be honest. Being able to do like couch co-op mode and just chilling in the couch and playing it. Amazing. Lunch, it's dinner time. Yeah, exactly. It's dinner time. <laughs> it's dinner time. Dinner time is after six. Uh, just get a stream app for the TV and stream it from your PC. Yeah. I could do that as well. I haven't quite figured out how I want to do that. Yeah, to be fair, if it's too complicated, I might just purchase like um, the game for both PC and console. Not that I'd want to do that, but maybe. Druid Werewolf. I want to play Necromancer. Yo, they're they're opening. Uh, was it like the 17th or 18th of May or something like that? The middle of May. We can play Diablo 4 again, right? Because they want to like stress test the servers. Uh, pretty pog. 12 to 14th of May. There we go. Yes. Then I'm gonna then I'm gonna try to play. I'm gonna check out Necromancer. That would be cool. That'd be cool. Five confirmed dragons Hello, Combo Jazz. Um, I'm not actually sure who gets access to that. I'm not sure if it's open for everyone or if it's just for the people who bought the game. Someone's gonna have to correct me on that. I just know. I just know that we'll be able to play. It's open for everyone, apparently. There you go, then. <laughs> oh hi, hi. Are you new here? <laughs> Yo, holy! How you doing? Cool. It's open for all. Yeah. Then I'm gonna I'm gonna try Necromancer. That's gonna be cool. You should definitely go to Gamescom if you decide to come to Germany. I would love to do that, and hopefully. I can go as part of my job. Maybe not this year, but soon. <laughs> that would be awesome. I've never been. So I would very much like to uh I would very much I would very much like to go. I <laughs> could throw it a follow. Thank you, combo. I hope you enjoy your time here in a silly little community. In my story mode guild wars right now i love it when you do the murloc sound it's the only party trick i have but it also only works for people that know world of warcraft everyone else is like why is val sound weird <laughs> why 
Why is she making weird noises? <laughs> oh, this instance? Oh, no. Am I gonna spend five hours throwing my body against something? How did it go? Did you get it? Yes, I got the cypher. This is a testimony to how scattered the Priory is right now. And how the only person who knows the cipher to get into the storage areas out in the silver wastes. It's good you saved her at Fort Selma. We need to speak to Mag <clears throat> We need to speak to Magister McKay. She's pulling some heavy duty strings to get us into the special collections. We're meeting a Magister Stone Healer. You don't know who Ogden Stone Healer is? I don't know who Ogden Stone Healer is. Am I supposed to know? <laughs> Has. He's one of the most magical beings I've ever met. He's a dwarf, the last of his race on the surface of Tyria. Brent alone knows how old he is. Hundreds of years at least. Oh, we're gonna meet a dwarf. Tell Casimir what happened to the others. Whoa. Centuries ago, many dwarfs turned themselves to, so to stone to save Tyria from Primordi Primordia's champion. Most went underground to fight destroyers. Ogden remains so their sacrifice would never be forgotten. That explains his area of expertise. Dragons. <gasps> dragons, 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 dragons. I love dragons. Sorry. I love dragons. Oh, I'm only gonna buy drinks for you at DreamHack. Now if you do the Murloc call every time you receive drinks. What if that becomes a thing? What if like random people just like start coming up to me with drinks just because they want to hear the Murloc call? That'd be the most embarrassing moment of my life. Dragons in your home. Dragons, dragons, dragons. Hi, I've Hello come again. to speak about dragons. The packed commander has arrived. Welcome, commander. I'm familiar with your accomplishments. Magister McKay is a world. Should make a party trick? You make Murloc, I make a Wookiee. <laughs> That's how we get our drinks at Dreamhack Mills. Real smart. Pays to chronicle them. Magister Stone Healer is going to help you gather information on the Elder Dragons. He rarely agrees to such things. I will warn you, he's quite old and has little patience. He's the last of his kind. We'll show him the utmost respect, of course. I'll take you to the special collections entrance. Archivist Earnsworth will guide you from there. You retrieved the cipher? Yes, we have it. We're gonna meet the well. famous dwarf. Okay. Out of the Harry Potter classroom. Where? Where is he? Where are we going? Faster. Oh my god, don't walk into me. That's a char. Remember to put those weapons near the door. We may need to grab them on Where are we going? Where are we going? Here. No. Hello, no, that's Stella. a dude. Still that's, waiting that's for <laughs> Yeah, I can also RP walk. That's <laughs> so much bigger than everyone else. Imagine if we lived in a world where, like, it actually was like this. Like, not just humans. For the millionth time, be amazing. no culinary application for bloodstone dust. None. No good can come from feeding it to living beings. Do chef. What do you <gasps> Take the dust I haven't eaten in ages. Eat me, please. Uh -huh. Are we interrupting something important, Chef? No, Madam Magister. We're just having a small professional disagreement. Are Look at those pants, methods? man. They fix. Yes. They have dispensation from. I'm not really sure what's going on with this hat, though. Oh my God! I'm sorry. I did not mean to enter your torso. I'll show you how it's done. I don't want to live in a world where people can just pick me up and yeet me like a football. <laughs> well, you shouldn't have picked playing in a Zoran then, should ya? <laughs> I'm joking. I see you're playing the superior race. Oh, yeah, yeah, I am. I am. And get this. Get this. When this comes back in rotation. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, my God. No, 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 no. I didn't mean to do that. Outfits. This, this is what I'm getting, just without the headpiece. <laughs> I don't even like Slumog, but I think this skin is so cool. I also want to look like a cosmic being. How amazing. Is it face? <laughs> no. <laughs> 
That is not why we're doing this. <laughs> that is not why we're doing this. I was only bigger in this game because she has to compensate for being smaller than everyone else. <laughs> to back. I can't help that everyone that I met was taller than me. <laughs> Space booba is best booba. <laughs> Guys. It used to be the most popular outfit since for a long time. Tried it using the right colors. It's the most revealing. What? What, you mean that people try to make it like flesh colored? I think it should be cosmic. I would definitely make the armor bits a different color so that they stick out a little bit more. Um, I don't actually want to look naked. I just think the skin looks amazing. Taller than you, is that a challenge? Nah. People like joking that I'm tiny, but I'm not that tiny. How tall are you, Free Funwear? Do you have any idea how many rocket jokes you can make? Oh my. Spa spare me. Spare me the, the rocket jokes about my spacesuit. <laughs> Boobas need space joke. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? There's just too many jokes here. There's just, there's just way, way too many jokes here. <laughs> oh. I was the second shortest in my college class. 182. What? But wait, what what country? Where do you live, Free Funware? It's like that's like average here okay maybe it's not what's the average i have for do for assuming you're a dude because that's definitely not sure for being a lady um i'm 164 i'm 164 yeah the average height for dudes in sweden is 180 but you said the netherlands and then i understand because everyone there is really really tall <laughs> Like, I've been watching a stream where that, um, was born in the Netherlands. Um, and then met her in real life. And was just like, I just did not expect her to be that tall. She's so tall. So, um, yeah. Everyone, everyone over there is really tall. That I understand. But, see, if you moved here, funware... You'd be above average. <laughs> like, if that makes you feel any better, it's all about context. It's all about which country you're in. <laughs> uh, Netherlands here too. I'm 193 and my sister is 186. Oh, you're just so tall. It's so tall. Everyone in my family is around 170. I'm the only one that's 185. I'm pretty much the same height as my mom. It's, um, it's pretty, yeah, we're, we're, we're a little bit shorter here. But I'm also like pretty much the average height for, um, a girl in Sweden, so. Uh, Emily? What? Snow Mixie? I have no idea. I'm trying to think. Uh, I feel like everyone's taller than me. Even if it's just like a little bit. I think, I think we're around like the same height. Just like based off memory. I can't really remember now. I feel like I need to see a selfie. Oh, the selfie from us from freaking DreamHack. Like, I'm just bending my knees down so that I like, fit with everyone else. Oh, whatever. I think we're about the same height. <gasps> is the secret entrance to the library behind this massive furnace? This is amazing. Look, there's a water gate. There's a water gate in the fire. Oh my goodness. Val's not super short or super tall. She's long over. 
Yeah, you guys that live in the Netherlands, so that you guys that are like really tall. What are the what are the side effects of being tall? Except for like leg room when you're flying, or like leg room in a car. Are there any other like side effects that aren't maybe that will be side effect? Any? Why am I saying side effects? Any like any cons? Or any uh, anything that's like? You ever wish that you were shorter? Oh, <gasps> what is that? That's a fish. That's a fish. Oh my god, this is amazing. <gasps> Look at this library. This is like one of the freaking old gods or some this crap. This is the German Priory's special collections. Security here is tight for reasons you'll soon understand. Oh, this is so cool. All we ask is that you handle artifacts with care and remove nothing from this area. I will not remove anything from this area. Now let me go. I want to explore. She can guide you to Magister Stone. Oh my god. Why is this RP? Oh my god, take away the RP walk. Abaddon, Lord of the Everlasting Depths, Keeper of Secrets, open my eyes and bestow upon me the knowledge of the abyss. Oh, see, I told you that was this. Uh, that that's a guy. That guy's a god. Uh, maybe he's not super. He doesn't look super friendly though. But maybe this is one of those neither evil nor benign situations. Oh, there's lots of artifacts here. You guys are really just going in without checking things out. They don't even appreciate all the art here. But look, there's another dude. Wait, are you guys telling me that there's achievements for dancing between between, between his legs? Uh in in front of the statues of the gods. Did I just like, get bamboozled or something? Oh my god. I cannot believe I cannot believe I just fell for that. I don't even have any I can I don't even have any energy to drain from anyone. Okay, here we go. That'll, that'll challenge me. Guys, we gotta talk about this. Seriously. We need... <laughs> we, need... we need to have some real talk here right now. What the heck was that? Obviously not the god of dancing. I can't believe you guys made me do that. I blame all of you as a collective. I blame every single one of you as a collective for having done that to me. I believed in you guys. I believed. I, I, I did do nothing. Uh, my HBO and I must say I've seen two or three episodes of Handmaiden's Tale in the series. Is, it is effing weird. It is. And if you keep on watching it, it gets weirder and weirder, Carl. It is so messed up. But it's good. Yeah, it's good but weird as hell. Yeah, it is. I would say if you buy Handmaiden's Tale. Okay, everyone except for Carl is exempt. I mean... I mean, everyone. I mean, Carl is exempt. Everyone else. It's tradition we do this to all streamers. Um, I demand compensation for the mental trauma that my character just went through. Look, look, she even wiped her brow. She's like... Well, now, which one are you going to compensate that? That men the mental trauma. Look at her. Look at her. She's like... Ooh, ooh. She's like half asleep. She can't even open her eyes properly. She's scarred for life. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for redeeming the daily cat tag. We can now continue our adventure. And I will go give the cat some pats for that later. For sure. I can't believe I listened to you guys. I didn't even get achievement for that, did I? I there was no there was no achievement. I think I got nothing. I just literally just got bamboozled. Wow. Uh, is NA? Uh, or I'm not NA. I play on an EU server. Okay, 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 okay. I got this. I got this. I got this. 
I got this. There was, uh, what do we got? History of Ascalon, Five Gods, Biography, Evening Song, Map of All. I don't remember where the last two scrolls were supposed to be, though. Oh, speak with the archivist. I'm supposed to speak to you first, but I'm trying to look for the right books. <clears throat> I got this. I guess we gotta talk to you. Are you delivering something? I've already buried in magical items. I don't have enough scribes. I need every piece. Every piece needs to be cataloged. Okay, I got this. I'm in a hurry, please. Magister Stone Healer is waiting for me, apparently. Let's get you on your way then. What can I help you find? I want to decide for the shelf numbers. And refers to cardinal directions of oh what the heck? The end refers to the cardinal direction of the main annex. Some alcoves are on the south side, some on the north. The second number tells you which floor, and the last number is which alcove. Elvete. Okay. I know what books. I know what books. No idea. King of the Dwarfs? Forgotten, not forgotten. Riding the Wind? The Tengu Exodus? Uh, History of Tyria, King of the Dwarfs. Wait, do I do I just have to read any three books or I, do I have to find the books? Uh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> puzzles are the worst part of this game. <laughs> I like puzzles. Oh no, except for that there's books everywhere. What the heck? Wait, am I actually supposed to find the right books? The human prize of char? Boats from Ventari the Centaur? Nightmare Harbinger? Okay, there was one hoofbeat thing. First edition of the collection, quotes of Ventari the Centaur below. What the free? There was once a time when human and centaurs lived in peace, but that was long ago. I'm afraid we will not live to see such times again come to Tyria. The outside world is a violent place, where seeds of chaos are sown with innocent tears. Centaurs are a proud race, fire with passion. They would not see humans as equals against the odds they fought. When humans rose to crush them, more consumed those lands and my home with it. Forging the path of serenity from the mind to the heart is more difficult than any battle foe would feel. The only peace is to be found within the self. Okay, this is a really long book. How long is this book? This is a whole book. They 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 put a whole book there. Okay, that's great. Anyway, um <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> Once watched a streamer that was a lore junkie. She read every single book in here. You know, I think that's amazing. Um, but heck no, just like heck no. I'm not gonna read every book in here. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Oh. Laura and Jory Britain are Lore Junkie. Yeah, that's that's kind of me as well. That's kind of me as well. <gasps> Echo! Uh, welcome back. How's it going? Quotes from... Wait, is that book there because I picked that book up? Wait, I can go upstairs. But there's so many books in here, though. Holy crap. Uh, hello again, Tim Tim. You're also cool. We're all cool. Um. <sighs> Being or playing a god. Okay, this is really not the. Okay. Uh, like seriously. Wait. Everyone, just calm down. I need to find the right books. I can't remember what she said. She said something about a a, a, a 
like a drum beats and hoofs. Something about a king that gave birth to a ghost. Okay, he didn't say ghost, but almost. Fathered a ghost or something. And and what was the last one? Uh Hoof beats the ghost. Can't remember what the last one was. Wait, the right ones are marked? What? That's cheating! Marked how? I have find a way through the... Oh my god. Wait, how the heck do I get up there? Oh, Dave, welcome back. That was a long way home. Mm -hmm. That's good, because I've already forgotten what the last line was about. Ashford History, Duke Baradin. This was the guy that he spent his life in Baradin the States making wine and trading warriors. Baradin's daughter, Althea, was betrothed to Prince Ruick, son of King Alberdine. Adelbert. I just made that up. That's not what it said. It said Adelbert. It said Adelbert. <laughs> uh, Althea was murdered by a char and her ghost remained restless until a renowned hero returned her ashes to Baradin. Okay, so that was the ghost. Centaur tribal culture and history. I would have I would have gotten this one. I would have gotten this one by myself. Would have gotten this one by myself. Because I, I knew that the, the, the hoof beat the hoof beat poem was was uh was indicating something with centaurs. I was the only one that I was confident about. Um that's about the centaurs. I just can't remember what the last one was about. The last one had a longer sentence. That's annoying me. Hi, Nemi. Welcome back. What's up? Yeah, guys, we got 13 minutes left for the giveaway. Exclamation mark gems. Uh, and I'll gift you an item of your choosing up to 650 gems. I think ashes is also an ascended trinket. And a quest item from Guild Wars 1. <gasps> That's cool. That's cool. No gems. It's gems. No gems. Okay, I think the last one is up there. You go up the stairs. Gems? No. G E M S. Exclamation mark gems. I didn't miss it this time. You did not. Jim. Okay, now you guys are. Now you guys are just being silly. The Great Hunt Rite of basic primer and ancient nor ritual called the great hunt i don't even remember i don't even remember what the the, the poem sentence was based on that holy crap oh. did it say already watched that thank you for the follow welcome welcome if you're having a lovely weekend Read the remaining books. A Great Golem Uprising. A cop the Great Golem Uprising. A commentary. Steward Gix gives his uncensored thoughts on the historic events and what it portends for the future. Not since the destroyers has Rathasum come so close to disaster as when the city's golems began to malfunction and turn on their makers. It was Terminator all over again. Oh my goodness. Hmm. One must consider the current peacemaker to golem ratio of 1 to 10. That's not good. I'm glad they uh, managed to solve that crisis. Am I going up or down? Uh, can I read? No! Alright. No! <gasps> Free ties on the shadow of the dragon. The shadow of the dragon is the name assigned to Mordremoth's champion. Oh, that's the guy we had to kick butt last uh, last stream. But I finally 
uh, finally perfected my dodging skills. <laughs> <laughs> this nightmarish creature has been spied in the dream and the world. While some believe it's immortal and cannot die, others do not. To date, there is no proof in either direction. Oh, what? I didn't actually kill it? That's not good. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh. This is so cool. There's gonna be a staircase in the middle. Uh. Yes. Awesome. I freaking love hidden passages and secret thingies. Hello, Sensei. Let me know if I botched your name. Welcome on in. Oh, there's a staircase. It was a it was a very short staircase, but we arrived. Ogden Stone Healer. It's just a pleasure and a privilege and oh my you oh. You really are took stone. So Getting a cipher from Explorer Campbell took longer than expected. Oh, he cranky. We're sorry for the inconvenience. Well, don't waste rocks. My time. No, absolutely no pun intended there, right? No pun intended. He's very stoned. <laughs> you guys. Oh my goodness. You guys. What am I supposed to do with you? That is the real question. He's got no hair as bald as a boulder. <laughs> General Stoner, sir. <laughs> the Dermon Priory in Order of the Whispers is the coolest because of the secret passages. Uh, it's really cool. I love it. Very, very cool. Very cool indeed. His voice is very gravelly. <laughs> Welcome in, Chop. Okay, what does he have to say? Oh no, I can't talk like a stony guy. I need a... Maybe he talks like this. Pico. These old ears are worse than my old eyes. No, I'm joking. Um... Yeah, but maybe he talks really slowly. You know, he's really old. Just pretend you're Danish. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, with age, he doesn't get more wrinkly, but more smooth. Smooth as a as a baby's butt dog. Too deep voice to understand. Ah, darn it. Well. What about... Oh god. Um... Maybe... Maybe... He talks like this? <laughs> no, he doesn't. <laughs> oh, how... How botch... Can this be? Maybe he sounds like this. Speak up. These old ears are worse than my old eyes. And they're worse than my old... Ah, never mind. Go on. <laughs> Ma Magister, it's me! Val, we met! Yes, yes. I remember you. No time for nostalgia. Get to the point. I need information about how to deal with Mordermoth. Actually, I think you need information about the meaning of your vision from the Pale Tree. What? How did you...? There are those who have taken an interest. I had some warning that you might be calling. Your cha... <laughs> your challenges do not go unnoticed. Who? All in good time. But you know, they have Tyria's best interests at heart. Now, this is what you're looking for. This artifact. Go on. Examine it closely. What is it? Don't ask. Act. Examine it. You shall see. 
as you wish. <laughs> How'd I do? <laughs> I, for one, welcome our new demonic overlord, Val. <laughs> Flabby! <laughs> Thank you for the follow. What's up? <laughs> uh, <laughs> mortar <laughs> Hello. Hi, CSR. Ugh. Mar- Marvelous. Marble. Really marvelous. It was marvelous. Um, yeah, I need to set presets for everyone's voices, apparently. <laughs> Thank you so much, Guardian Alpha Dragon. I have much enjoyed my stay in Tyria so far. So far, so far, so far. You're marvelous. You're the last. He also kind of looks like... Oh, that, that one doesn't work in this scene. Wait. There. He also cancelled look. Listen, we do not look the same. What is your problem? Save hi! Oh my god. I cannot believe you guys. I cannot. Anyway, I'm gonna go inspect the Orn and Hourglass right now. This or an hourglass is made of precious metals and has a palpable aura of magic. Don't be shy. You can touch it. <laughs> this is so cursed. I'm touching it. Whoa, 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 whoa. He did not warn me about this. What? Uh, heck. Valdi fake. <laughs> Alright, sometimes you gotta be creative. <laughs> I need to find a posh one for it. Marjorie. What just happened? I... I don't know. But my legs feel like sight happy. Oh, this is such a cool place. Wait, why is Kismir and why are they over there? Hello. You think I can jump? <laughs> okay, we're gonna do it. it is this Hi guys. Glint's <gasps> lair. Where are we? It's even more Glint's lair. Wait, who the heck is Glint? And eerie. It doesn't look like we'll be leaving the same way we It's came so in. pretty in I here. I never thought I'd see this. Where's the boss? Hello? When our rock dwarf relieves himself, is it sand or <laughs> I don't know, is it sand? <laughs> Thunderbrew, hello, hello, welcome on in. Flint is the dragon champion that sided with the sentient races against Kral. Oh, <gasps> there's a good dragon. Wait, I think I've heard of this before, I'm pretty sure. Sleepy school. Thank you for the hydrate. After all of this amazing voice acting, I obviously need it. Boss, it doesn't look like we can reach you from here. This place, it's something else entirely. Maybe our paths will intersect beyond here. Right, you look for a path up ahead and I'll do the same on my side. Be safe. Lint may no longer live here. That doesn't make her lair any less dangerous. I'll be fine. See you up ahead. Search for a place to meet. I love this place, it's so pretty! A bit, boss. Stay safe. Since when did she start calling me boss? Don't anyway. Challenge mode. I wanna click it. Or is it gonna activate when I run past this? What if I jump this way? Okay, fine, let's just do it. From inside this mode of pure mist's energy, a voice asks, Worthy adventurer, would you like a challenge? I feel like I'm going to get a challenge regardless. Hmm. Yep. Hold it. Hold it. Yo, the giveaway! 
drum rolls. I don't have drum rolls. We have apparently 50 seconds left. The the thing is lagging. <laughs> Exclamation mark gems to enter. Hello, Kirby. Oh my god, Kirby. Have you heard my amazing voice acting? Huh, let's just uh finish let's just wrap up this giveaway <laughs> before I can kind of kick the butt of this uh positive strength. Alright. I don't have a drum roll, but let's pretend there's a drum roll. <laughs> this thing is so uh laggy. It's just stuck on 18 seconds. I think it's trying to push, uh, I think it's trying to push the announcement through. No, oh, there we go. Guru, if you're here, yes, you are. Oh, it always makes me so happy when, when, <laughs> when you're still here to claim your prize. <gasps> nice. Oh, Buzz Lightbear, welcome back. How are you doing? Hello. I didn't see you sneak in there. Congratulations, Guru. Send me your in-game name. And then let me know when you have an item that you would like me to gift. Up to 650 gems. Congratulations! Yoohoo! Okay, that's really lame, I know. But I have sound effects on my stream deck if anyone cares. And here's the kitty cat as well. Someone wanted to summon the kitty cat. Siento. Here's the kitty cat. I've had a wonderful day. Thank you, Buzz. Good to see you again. I'm glad you're rad. Enjoying my weekend. Having a nice Sunday. Playing Guild Wars. Uh, playing more story mode. Thank you so much for the lurk, Kai. Sharky, sharky, sharky. Okay, but yeah, Guru, uh, let me know what your in-game name is in Guild Wars. And there we go, Dark Sorcerer. Okay. Is there a space in Dark Sorcerer? This we'll find out. I don't know if you can have space. Or you can have space. I have space in my name or had. No. Duh, because I had a space in front of the thing. There we go. All right, you'll be added. Let me know when you know what item you would like me to gift you. If you can't make up your mind uh, before the end of stream feel free to just send the name of the item either as a whisper in twitch or you can join our discord and write in the guild wars channel hello over good luck with your raid thank you so much for the lurk how do we know it's a cat and not a i hit in the sky either are you a cat he said yes i'm a cat i can talk to cats I, I, he's a cat He's like, oh, yo, look at this guy. He's like, yo, 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 yo. He's like, I'm just here for the scratches. Your leopard is the size of a cat. He is. Uh, he's a little leopard, isn't he? He very much is. He's as ferocious as one as well. Okay, let's see if I can kick the butt of this pulse of strength. Distorted. Pulls, stuns, cripples, knockbacks, and summons allies on hit. My hits or its hits? I think I'm about to get my butt handed to me. We'll, uh, we'll find out. Oh, bruh. Yo. Holy crap. This guy's aggressive. Really aggressive. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, what? I didn't get hit. This is BS. They see me rolled in. <laughs> okay. It was, uh. Nothing can bring me down. It's Roda? No, oh, no, no, push road out. Okay, sorry, my bad. Aha, take that. 
Oh. Okay, that was easy. What are you talking about? I thought that was gonna be hard. Everything else that I've done combat why has this been so freaking hard? <laughs> Trying to figure it out. Yeah, yeah, no worries. Like I said, Guru, um, no stress. Uh, but yeah, you can... <clears throat> You're welcome to join Discord. Ping me there or whisper me in Twitch. All the good stuff. Buzz Lightbearer is an awesome name. I agree. Necromancer, Agent of Death. Summon one of the undead pools, pile of rocks, and chrysalis that can move and jump aggressively. <gasps> I would like to be Crystal Summoner. Crystal Minions. Okay, Glowing Crystal. What is this? I'm going to expect the Glowing Crystal. <gasps> Hi. Wait, can dragons take human form? I oh, know, wait. Maybe not. My father used to talk about Glint in her prophecies. He said she was grand and noble, as noble as any Crichton. She loved humans, except when they tried to steal her eggs. She defended her children like any good mother. There's no booba here, though. Maybe that's not Glint. My mother told me Can't really see properly. <laughs> She said it was once guarded by fearsome dragons. The lair itself would tame the But heroes braved its dangers to have an audience with Glint. Can you imagine what it must have been like? Well, you shouldn't try to steal anyone's eggs, to be fair. Scripted code not here. Oh, all the all the shinies. Yes, yes, the shinies. I like the shiny. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just got TP'd even further away from my friends. Summon force Nay, hey, I don't I can't go this way. I have to go this way? Oh, I have to go this way. Okay, these are just tiny ones. This is fine. Yeah, like, this is okay. I'm like, who am I trying to convince myself? What is this crystal place? Okay, so this is the lair of a dragon called Glinda. Um, I wanted to say Glinda. Glinda. The nice one. The nice witch. Uh, Glint. Which was a dragon. Which is a good dragon. A nice dragon. How do you make a square go crazy? Put him in a circular room and tell him that there's shinies in the corner. Shinies. What is this red ball and why do I have to stand in it? Uh, protective bond? For 22 seconds, I'm immune. Oh shit! Okay. I hope that was it. Because I'm running out of shield now. Oh, there's another shield thing there. Cool. They just, they're just attacking me because Glint isn't here anymore. And they don't know that I'm actually a good guy. Because she can't communicate to them. Now you That's why. But that's okay. You know, I'm, hopefully they'll come back to life later or something. <laughs> Jason Space, welcome. Thank you so much for the follow. Nah, Glint's gonna come in at the end and like save the day or something. Wait, where am I going after this? Oh, up there? What? I didn't even get the shield. You're not giving me a shield this time? Increases toughness per stack. Okay, apparently I'm just taking damage. I have increased toughness. I have no idea if this is going to kill me or not. Oh, that, that, that was going to kill me. Okay, I was supposed to get a bubble. It didn't give me a bubble. This is BS. I didn't get a bubble. Okay, let's try again. Maybe I get a new bubble.
da 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 Sky skill chair. Okay, I don't think it's gonna I'm in an instance now and last time I tried to gift it an instance it was like really bugged out. Um Sync with matching coloring to Oh no! No, I understand now. Oh okay, 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 I understand now. There we go. Let me uh let me get out of this instance and then sky scale chair. What does that look like? I just... What? Okay, I did not get the extra seconds there. I need to kill all of these and then pick up the red thing. So I can get a new bubble. Quickly. Be back later, thanks again. Yeah, no worries. Thanks for hanging out. And thank you for whispering that to me as well. Okie dokie. Ugh. 20 seconds. <clears throat> Just enough time to get over here, right? I can see where I'm going. Is that... Do I have to jump? Or is this actually... I can't tell if that's a glass or crystal bridge or if i'm screwed if i fall down oh okay there was another challenge mode there's a distorted face of lights up there i just want to see what this sky scale chair looks like i'm kind of imagining what it looks like well, am i being attacked already squee sky scale air Ooh. It's actually a little sky scale that you and you sit in there and you look super cute. Oh, <gasps> okay. I'm gonna try, but I don't think I can do it in here. Um, da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 no, no, I did wrong. The sorceress. That's what you're called in game. Why am I taking so much damage in here? Yeah, the sorceress. Here we are. Right? Dark sorcerer. The sorceress. I'm so dying. Nay! Why? Why did you? Let me just do this. All right. Okay. Apparently, I'm taking ticket damage in here. Domain of health draining. Oh, that wasn't so good. Oh, well. <laughs> I can heal myself. It's fine. Oh, you can give scritches. The chair? That is so cute. So cute. XG generosity? No worries. Once again, thanks for hanging out. I have received very much from the community. <laughs> and I like giving back. Why are you out of range? I need to do something special. I need to like attune. Uh oh. Uh oh, I was supposed to attune with the blue one. And I messed up. There are no more little guys to kill. Um. Oh, there's a little guy. Okay, here we go. What? The little guy died. Defense, then offense. Okay, I understand what I'm supposed to do now. Me to conditions. For how long? It's just mean. At least I can heal myself. Soon. Soon. I need to have a tune with the colors. I missed that. I will not this time though. Okay, blue, 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 blue. Give me blue, give me blue. What does blue give me? 
means I can go in and fight this guy. Okay, cool. I'm getting better at this game. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I'm getting better at this game. I'm way too cocky. What is my shield running out? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I didn't get that much hits on this guy. Can I do damage from you if I stand over here? No, I actually need to be inside. Okay. Defense, then offense. Good Val has a healing class. Yeah, I think there's a reason why everyone's like, yo, Necro is easy. <laughs> it's one of the best starting classes. Imagine her playing warrior. Nay. Nay. That sounds like a really bad idea. But I think you need to run over these to get real. Okay, no, never mind. Okay, what color are you? Green. Green. Yo, let's go. Ten seconds. Five. Four. Okay, get out of there. I don't want to get like one shot. We get halfway. We got halfway. More than halfway. Oops. I got yeeted. Send one of your minions. Aha. There's a minion. What? That's not a minion. Oh, there's a minion. Oops. I got this. What color is this minion? This minion's green. It's in the bowl in. Another bubble. Go, 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 Val. Get him. Get him. <gasps> Hello, fading. Oh my god, I just finished my giveaway. Woo! That was close. Okay, one more. Oh, I was so close. <gasps> fading, have a boop. How are you? Good to see you again. Okay, but I play I play a warrior in, in World of Warcraft. So what do you mean with this, Frogman? Hmm? What do, you, what do you want to say with this? Me when Val says he's no longer a WoW streamer. Why you get happy about that? I still love WoW and I definitely will not stop Frogman Young Sanders playing it. Gifts a tier 1 sub to fading velocity. They have given 16 gift subs in the channel. Whoa, no way, Frogman, what the heck? You're cray cray. Thank you so much for gifting fading a sub. Thank you. Oh my god, you got me distracted and I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it with my buff. Five. I made it. Okay, all is forgiven. All is forgiven, frog. Thank you so much. Okay, I won. I won. Is that an outfit or an item the way they fit? Uh, all of this is just one item. Or one uh, outfit, sorry. Yeah, this is all an outfit that I'm wearing. So I don't have any I don't have any special bits and bobs or anything like that. Is that it because you would have a really bad time as a warrior? <laughs> I will take your advice and don't play warrior until I'm a real veteran then. It's very cool. How do I check my sub level if I haven't reset? Yeah, click your own name and you get all the info. You get all the beats. In school. Me too. I remember the stories. Oh, I don't think that works in mobile. Prince Rorik, the chosen. Uh, I used to pretend I was a you've been uh, you've been sub for nine Me months. We've been following yeah. since February Just the third of last year. Lynn was Asian thousands of years old. She was freed from Oh, well, since she liked the elder dragons. Long, long time ago. And then, because of her gift for reading minds, she was freed from Calcatoric's control by the Forgotten a long time ago. Like elder dragons don't. Those Calcatoric like the big bad evil. Different. I keep up, I keep on thinking that he's like Albatorix. And have you guys read Paolini's um Inheritance cycle, you know, Aragon and the dragons. 
Frogman no knows way. Artists were gifted a tier one sub to Nomic 07. They Yo. have given 17 <laughs> gift subs in the channel. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Frogman, thank you so much. Thank you. Yo. That is super, super, super kind of you. I cannot believe we're back up at 100 subbies now. Thanks for gifting Nomika sub. I have another boob. Oh my goodness. Uh, you guys are spoiling me rotten today. Thank you kindly. The great advantage of warriors, the weapon pool, they can wield almost any weapon. What well, weapon types in game? That sounds like Warrior in World of Warcraft. We could also wield most of it. <laughs> How long have you been following? <laughs> yeah, um, following since two hours ago, Avrenis. <laughs> oh my goodness. Frogman, thank you so much. Seriously. Loki, welcome back. How have you been? feels like forever ago oh, i know i can't believe i put up with you for two hours <laughs> feels so much longer <laughs> no i'm joking i'm joking the domain of darkness discovered oh <gasps> that's not nice i like nice places i want to go nice places whoa you guys I'm really bad at jumping puzzles, by the way. <laughs> I'm just going to assume that I can walk on the crystal stuff, but I'm still going to jump just in case. Hmm. Um, all right, find a way through. So it looks like there's a bunch of spiky mines that are going to try to kill me. Is this a good bubble? This is a good bubble. For 20 seconds, it's a good bubble. Am I even gonna make it to the end? Oh, wait, that wasn't a good bubble. Whoa, that's bad. Need support. Uh, can I even make it? But no, it doesn't matter if I survive because I don't have the bubble, so I'm just gonna instantly die again. Oh, this is bad. Can I jump here? <laughs> no, I can't. Um, um, what's a vortex crystal? <laughs> oh, it's immune. I really hate this mechanic. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't really think I'm going places. Damages is nearby faucets on death. That's great. Then how can I <laughs> how can I even do damage to it? Absorbs boost from enemies every two seconds. I'm pretty sure I need to get that freaking bubble over here. Oh my okay, well I need to die. Cause I ain't going anywhere. <laughs> Did it get through here? This thing needs to be destroyed for this to open. Okay, or maybe I don't have to die. Maybe I can just sneak my way back. <clears throat> I didn't. I didn't realize I had to be safe while doing this. I thought I could just uh, go through the whole place. Okay, I probably should have waited for some of the crystals to spawn, but YOLO. Uh, there we go. Ha! <laughs> She's so smart! <sighs> oh my goodness. That's okay, guys. You can, uh, you can all applaud later. <laughs> I'm such a kid. Uh, I think my last three subs would be gifted subs here. Val, community, wholesome. I'm such a lucky streamer. We have a very, very lovely community. Yes. Yes, indeed. Hmm. 
Another challenge mode? Oh my goodness. The distorted face of darkness. Okay, so... Is someone gonna give me a... Oh, shoot. Oh, there's a bubble. Why did I get the bubble? Now I got the bubble. Okay, you have to come here. Come here. Come here. No, no, no. Closer, closer, closer. Oh, this is bad. You were supposed... Oh, did I... Yes. Okay, I did a thing. I need more bubbles. <laughs> oh, I need more bubbles. Oh. There's a bubble. Got a bubble. I... Oh. Oh. Oh, wow. I just got slapped. Okay, dude. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't see the slappy. The, the, the really big slappy there. Ouch. No, 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 That's unfair. Okay, there's a bubble. You want to come over here, my dude? Okay. Okay. More, uh... More boobless piece. Can I heal on you? Oh, I can. Nice. Here's a bubble. I guess we just do this until it dies. Right? What are you on? 62%? Need more bubbles. Oh, there's crystals, though. There's crystals as well. <gasps> Is this getting harder and harder? I need, I need a bubble. Whoops. There's a bubble. Oh, for crying out loud. Wait, why is there no hitbox animation? <laughs> why? What am I missing with the big slappy dong? Oh, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. Okay, where's the bubble? There's a bubble. Oh, I didn't mean for you to absorb the. Oh. Come here, 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 Did you wanna go stand on this guy, please? Come here. No, 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 no. That, 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 that thing, though. That thing is scary. That, that there. That's big scare. Stop slapping! Oh, that guy, apparently, that has a much longer range than I said. Stop slapping. <laughs> uh... I thought he had to actually stand, like, on it, but apparently, it's quite. Quite a quite a large range. You guys see a bubble anywhere? Bubble? Bubble? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god, the bubble is right under him. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, like one more, maybe two max. <sighs> <laughs> I'm glad the Merlocks are working now. Oh my god, this is terrifying. The bubbles under him. Ah! Did we win? We won! We did it! I did a thing! Bluebees? <laughs> bubbles, epic. Bubbles. Bubbles. Needed to get the bubbles. Okay. Why can't I not talk to this crystal? <laughs> what? Is this bugged out? I swear to god. Okay, here we go. Oof. Hello there. This memory and crystal. Like, oh, what is this thing that I found? Oh, he's strong. 
He just lifted something that I bet weighs uh really much. I Big chunk of crystal. Destiny's edge went to kill her, right? So she wouldn't wake Krakatoric? That's my understanding. What? She communicated with them. This these edge was gonna kill Glenn? They tried to take down Krakatoric, but they ultimately failed. Oh, oh, but they okay, 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 okay. Logan Thackeray was supposed to be with them. They, they teamed up against the bad, the bad dragon, with the good West. dragon. Fuck you! Some blame Logan for why Glint died. How did I destroy? Yeah. He was just doing his duty. Shh. What was that? Did you hear that? Wait, something's coming. Please no. Uh, they're the little bubbles I was picking up. That, that's that's a buff, right? It's like a boon. That's what it's called in this game, but it's a buff. And then those little like vortex shadowy crystal things, what they do is that they absorb a buff or a boon from whatever. They just absorb boons. So then it took my bubble. And if you take any damage when you have that bubble, you like get one shot. Basically. Or something. And then when the crystal, the, the void crystal things, then they explode. When they die and they did damage to the the mini boss oh my god i can't wait to kick this guy's butt it's gonna be the evilest dragon of all time okay <laughs> one more path to follow uh can't stop moving listen Sorry? what was that that krakatoric yeah. that bad dragon Oh, <gasps> what's this? It's a puzzle. Oh no, it's a big dude. Are they gonna help me this time or they're just gonna chill? Oh, you got, you got this. Marjorie, go, 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 go. Crack is the cool. Well, I hope, th I hope that they met Crack, a cool dragon. I obviously won't see him until we get to that part of the story, but it seems like he's the biggest, baddest, so he better be the coolest. I guess I'll see him when I get there. Okay. Oh no. Okay, there's a bubble. And there's a crystal. And uh uh and he's after me. And the bubble disappeared. There's a bubble. Uh oh. What? You didn't absorb my boon? I didn't know stand there long enough. Okay. He took some damages. He's not taking any damages from me, so more bubbles. <clears throat> Wait, there's no more vortex shield thing. Oh, it's under him. Never mind. Nothing can bring me down. Uh oh. Wait a second. Oh no! Oh come on, that's spawn. That was unfair. Marjorie, would you help me up? Eat pain. That was just mean. That was just mean. Okay, what color are you gonna give me? Oh my god, it's Is that green? Ah green's all the way over there! Okay, I've got time. I have time. Wait, there's a crystal here? Oh please don't tell me I have to combine the Oh no, I don't. Whew. I got really worried there for a second. Like, I'm never gonna have time to do this. Get him! I'm not doing any damage! Oh my god! Ah! Might have targeted the wrong thing for a sec- WHAT?! Wait a second, I wasn't paying attention. What killed me? Oh, was it his AoE projectile? That's okay, Marjorie's got this. Marjorie. No, Marjorie, heal me! Aster! We'd expect! A little help! Ah. Uh, well, this is kind of awkward. And you thought I was defeated. Ha! Okay, green. Let's go. What?
Wait, I'm not actually doing any damage to him. But there's no thing in there. Or was there a crystal void thing? No, you need to come over to me. Can I taunt this somehow? Uh... Okay, wait. I need to rethink my strategy here. Hmm... Ready? Are you somehow preventing me from like... Oh, okay. Somehow something was preventing me. Never mind. Then I guess we go back to uh, bubble tactic. I'll be all right. Soon. Nothing can bring me down. Absorb me no 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 what ha oh did it just disappear oh no we did it we did more damage to him i need another void crystal <laughs> i need something <laughs> i need to apparently not die <laughs> we're halfway there whoa <laughs> Living on a prayer. Okay, there's a void crystal. And now all I need is a bubble. Okay, it's a vortex crystal. I call it a void crystal. There's a bubble. Bubble. Marjorie, are you killing my vortex crystals for some reason? Please stop doing that. There we go. This is the right. The, this is. What? <laughs> no, but you can't spawn the stinky stuff under me when I'm there. No! <laughs> No! Oh no, I'm so glad this game is so forgiving. <laughs> it spawned the stinky stuff right under me, bro. I wasn't ready. Oh my god. Okay. Da, 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 da. thanks for trying to protect for the spoilers and yeah like please do refrain from the spoilers uh in this case i guess i always assumed that i'd battle alcator at some point i needed to get the shield somehow oh my god um i don't know i wasn't really reading exactly what you guys were talking about but i assume that he's the last biggie biggie betty dragon that was so that was so scuffed hello seven thank you for the follow welcome on in <laughs> good timing uh okay why well, just wait for another bubble or what you're my bubble stop pooping everywhere Do excuse me this looks like frog poop to me I'll tell you that much okay this really isn't helping me I'm still not allowed to do any damage to this guy. Need a bubble. There's a bubble. See a bubble. I need the color because I can't attune to the vortex. See? But it didn't work last time. Give me a dude. Let's just let me do this again. How long do I get to keep this bubble? What? Oh, because I had the bubble on me. Oh, yeah. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I know what I did wrong. <laughs> I know what I did wrong. But hello, I can't I can't get a bubble. There we go. No 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 come on come on come on come on come on come Ah no I lost the I lost the thing. Okay, I need an another small dude. And I really don't want to have the bubble. Can I get rid of the bubble somehow? Oh shit, I'm gonna get one shot. Don't want the bubble on me. Just don't want the bubble on me right now. Oh wait, that was the wrong bubble, I just realized. That was fine. Nothing wrong with that bubble. I was thinking wrong. But that's the bubble I need. Uh. Oh, wait. We fixed it. It's fine. It's all good.
Any, uh, any tactics? There we go. Thank you. Hit it, Marjorie. Hit it. It's so long since I've seen early content for Killers 2. Well... I gotta, I gotta start some way into my, my journey into Tyria. So yeah, I, uh... Progressed Living World Season 1. And then... Here we are, season two, or <clears throat> the uh, last half of season two, anyway. Just trying to work out all the kinks. This whole, uh, <clears throat> this whole dodging, <laughs> all these dodging shenanigans. Oh, he's gonna do the big thing. I learned third time's a charm. I, I finally learned how to. Uh... Oh, for crying out loud! Speaking of learning anything. Thanks. Can we kite this over there, Marjorie? Because I got to run all the way over. Oh, okay. I also need a bubble. But the bubbles are under stinky things. Can I have a safe? Oh, there's a safe bubble. No, that's not a safe bubble. Oh. I just lost eight seconds. Eight seconds. I can do this. Eight seconds. Roll, Val. Roll. Easy. Okay. One, maybe two more stinky crystals. Where did you come from? I don't care about you. I want this void crystal here. There we go. Yeah! What? Seriously? He's got like 7% left. Okay. Some more stinkies. He's doing great with the little guy, by the way, Marjorie. Real great. Uh oh. Void. 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 Oh, there. Vortex crystal. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> I gave my boon to the crystal. <laughs> Oh, no, don't kill me again. We were so close. Come on. You could do it, Marjorie. Heal. Heal. Up, up, up. Dude, can you not do that? Yes. Good job. I didn't want to walk back the entire way again. Okay, one more shield. I need one more shield there. There. See it. Okay, we're winning now. What? Didn't even pick up my shield. Oh my god. Mon dieu. Okay, Here we go. Damn. Easy. <laughs> I win. I want to do a workout. Take care of our chat. It was so good to see you again. Okay. Good luck with your workout. Hope you have a good one. Uh, don't injure sure. anything. Don't, don't cheese doodle. <laughs> see you later, Ace. Kirby? There's been like four week. different things. Okay. <laughs> We'd have been toast if not for you. There's been a lot of different mm -hmm. things. We weren't sure we'd see you again, to be honest. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Something. Oh, I still have half my fake Oreo cookie. What? I did not hear. Did you trying to steal an egg? Or no cheese doodles. Was no, but you don't want a cheese doodle when you're at the gym, right? Because that's bad. Let's find a way out of here. Because you don't want to break your, you don't want to, you don't want to injure your back somehow. That would be really, really, really bad. <laughs> that's why I said don't do the cheese doodle when lifting. Anyway, lift with your legs, not your back. All that good, good advice. Ooh, what's that? I swear you got TP one more. You got TP me one more time. I'm so done with this. Oh my god, we did it! We did it! <laughs> the looks on your faces. Okay, my voice is clearly better than his voice. Nope, no, no, no. That would have sapped the fun right out of it. So tell me, what do you know now that you didn't before? I can't believe. Entertain an old dwarf. Tell me your tale. There's a portal to Glint's Lair, and you knew it. Hmm. So it was. The master of peace, and I set it up after Glint's death. 
if I could guard it for the Brotherhood. I saw the Master of Peace take an egg. The last one intact. It has been in stasis since her death. The Master of Peace is taking it where it will be safe and allowed to hatch. Yo! They're hatching a dragon egg. Maybe a good dragon egg. <laughs> Well, sounds like a girl was restoring it when she saw that. <laughs> oh, this is the epitome of my voice acting. It's never getting better than this. Except for that, I guess, in the voice acting. It's a OXLR, but. <laughs> Yo. Where did he take the egg? Sadly, I do not know that. He disappeared beyond dry top and I have had no word since. You'll find him, won't you? He's in great danger out there. Okay, now we really need to find the masterpiece because he's got the egg and everything or knows where the egg is. This is why you were chosen for this. Go now, find him and make sure he arrives safely at his destination. What is his destination? Only he can tell you that. Go be smart do not rush into danger unprepared you have many trials ahead of you yes magister i'll be careful du, 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 du. hidden arcana completed i am awesome oh that was the end of the chapter as well episode complete Okay. Echoes of the past. Now a tangled path. As the pack continues its preparations for the fight against Mordremoth, a new opportunity arises. But the search for the Master of Peace ends in tragedy, calling into question the motives of a friend. Hmm. Well, hopefully we can uh, salvage the egg from that. <gasps> Look at all this loot. Look at all this loot. All this loot. A fitting reward. I am Apophis, and you shall kneel. Here you go. Are you happy, Kirby? And another mass report. I'm so close. I need to get more exp Like, is there a way to farm mastery experience faster than this? <laughs> I'm like, I have all these points. But it takes such a long time to get to XP. I want my advanced logistics. I cannot wait to get my advanced logistics. Honestly, if it bugged out and and sent me back in to have to like redo it all, I'd probably just like go cry in a corner and then, and then just do it off stream. <laughs> no, there is actually. Oh, okay, nice. I guess we gotta get on that meta train. More gameplay, less lure. <laughs> okay. It's about the journey, not the destination, Val. I can't believe you throw that at me. I have a bunch of tomes of knowledge. Somewhere. And a bunch of boosters and stuff. Okay, what did I get? Ooh. What? Okay, that's heavy. That's medium. And that's light. These are awesome. How was that? Give me. Give me the, 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 that one. I like doing it old fashioned because you get more experience of the game and loot. I mean, yes. That is true. That is fair. Wait, why are we? Why did we pin that? This is the quote quote of the day. Okay, I got some cool loot. I got some stuff in my boxes. Double click to equip a shovel, especially designed for finding lost bandit chest. Oh yeah, my lost bandit chest I thingies. I like it. I like it. Speaking of tomes of knowledge. 
those other tomes. I put them in my bank with all the other ones. Wow, my loot boxes have loot boxes. Oh my god. No, 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 no. I meant, I meant, to not to do that. Oh my god. Wait, this stuff automatically gets added to my appearance, right? I know I've talked about this before, but okay, it's already gone unlocked. It's fine then. Why are you clip this? <laughs> oh, you yeah, are. Is it worth keeping this though? Maybe it is. Even if it's only rare and not exotic. I'll put them there for now. So you guys answer. Get rid of everything else. Yellow? Nope. A yellow? Nope. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I have two exotic shoulders with different stats, so... Thanks, though. I just wanted to make sure. I want to get... Oops, there was some unidentified stuff there. Ah, well... <laughs> Every time I do this, my bags just get more and more full. I try, though. I try. Am I getting rid of it? Everything I can. Oh no, I can open dust. Nice. Can you get anything else from the, the silky sand other than the sand? <laughs> okay, I need to go sell stuff. All right. All right, all right, all right. Get okay, keys and geos for your map currency. Yeah, I, I got a bunch of... Uh, keys for another map but you can actually get cooler stuff from the dust i only get dust from my dust hello again just uh, you just got home what have you been out what have you been out and about doing today i wonder sand makes sense who would have thought i got some bandit keys from something else though i don't remember what but i think i have some keys somewhere I get like bandit keys. What happened with those? Okay, apparently I'm making stuff up. No, 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 no. Never mind. I it was the item that told me. No, I swear I got bandit keys. I swear it was like if you find a chest, you can now open because you have five keys. Am I making things up in my head? Did I not receive some kind of key? <laughs> Bandit keys go into the selection bottom left. Oh, wait, in here? Wait, are you telling me bandit? Oh, bandit skeleton keys, six of the Oh, there we go. Thank you. I thought I was going insane for a moment there. <laughs> Thanks, Kirby. I was like, I swear. <laughs> Hello, man. Manges. Welcome. Thank you for the follow. Sorry for botching your name. Hmm. Okay, that was quite fun, Any Glint's there was, uh, that was pretty fun. No bad. No bad. Indeed. Yeah, I know. I still have to get, like, wrap my head around that as well. Map-specific currencies. There's so many currencies for different stuff. <laughs> I mean, I think even you guys have said that there's, like, so many currencies in this game. You don't even, you don't even know. And I mean, just... Look at all these currencies. So much. I suppose it's not maybe excessively as much more than like WoW has. Just WoW likes to deal in like lots. Like they just call it different things. Tokens or stuff you need for certain like reputations and vendor factions and stuff like that. I guess it just feels a lot when you're looking here. It's not like that bad, really. It's probably more overwhelming for me because I have no idea what any of these things do besides like gems and coins. <laughs> That's it. No, but almost.
You don't name a fourth of them from the top of your head? Makes me feel better. Most are invalidated as you get past them though, but because it's not in your inventory, it's fine. Yeah, that's fair. We're going to mess a bit more with stuff like... Yeah, I saw that by the way. Well done on uh, teaching yourself how to edit videos, by the way, Jester. That's awesome. I wish the first one that you posted uh, like a couple of weeks ago. Glenn's there is pretty fun. Stream of Val is pretty and fun. Oh, shucks. Oh, I've had the fortune of meeting so many lovely Guild Wars uh, community members on Twitch. It's been lovely. And I think it's nice that I have, uh, that I'm able to play like two MMOs and stream them and just like chill with you guys. And it's also very like when I tried doing Final Fantasy 14 and while at the same time it was very <laughs> it was kind of tense because I had like two communities that were kind of at their throats a little bit. I, I think it's better a little bit better now, but it was very much WoW versus Final Fantasy like back when there was the whole like hype that like Final Fantasy is the WoW killer and it was going really badly for WoW and Final Fantasy was having this like huge like well, what do you want to call it like hype trade on Twitch or whatever but I feel like Guild Wars players are more accepting of World of Warcraft than finally Final Fantasy players are like generally not, not as individuals I know there are plenty of you guys that play like all MMOs. Um, Final Fantasy 14 community being toxic. No, I couldn't believe it. I think it's a pity because like I also want to give Final Fantasy a try again properly. As soon as I get out of the main at least 80 quests I have to get into Heaven's Word. Um, but I know that there's so much tribalism. So, take away a day in that time, we'll get fat. This is past and I'm home. Is it that? Isn't that a song lyrics? That's song lyrics, Yin. He's quoting the song. <laughs> what is the WoW community like? I only played that game for five minutes before I ditched it, so. Um, like. I, I obviously kind of get to choose a little bit who my community is, right? Like, if I don't like how someone's behaving i'll just ban them from the channel not for valid opinions or anything like that but if someone's coming in just to be like a douchebag and just hate on a game or whatever uh or be toxic they're out the community like in wow can be very very toxic depending on what kind of content you do unfortunately that's why i tend to surround myself with people that i know I enjoy playing with that are decent <laughs> but the wow community on twitch is nice at least the ones that i've come across um i think i have like an overlapping community with quite a few other wow streamers and it's all like a really nice bunch of people um and i mean seeing as i started streaming playing just wow there's a bunch of people here right now that you know just play wow that are still hanging out while i play guild wars like epic that does not play guild wars <laughs> considering i'm still here to be real doing <laughs> yes epic has not gotten banned i don't know how i don't know how you're not banned um i only play wow but i love wow <laughs> Well, community is a community for sure. Yeah, no, but like it's nice. It's always nice when I see people that like only play Guild Wars sometimes pop in to say hi and chat a little bit when I when I play WoW or vice versa. Like now when I play Guild Wars, a bunch of the WoW regulars are still here to chat. I've I've I feel like I feel like WoW community and the Guild Wars community just, just tolerate each other like a little bit more 
than the Final Fantasy community and the WoW community did, like, cross both. We're here to make Val feel guilty about betraying us. I haven't left WoW permanently, Michael. But yes. A few people came out of the lurkies just to prove my point, and I do appreciate you guys um, hanging around when I play other games. Because, like I've said a few times, I do kind of want to branch out to some variety, and I think it's nice not having to feel like I'm forced to play one specific game all the time. How have I not banned? I got everyone's just like, how am I not banned yet? Well, it's guys, there's a difference between banter and being like a little bit cheeky and then also yeah i don't know being a douche intentions and timing yeah yeah i think it's quite flattering to see how wow well sometimes coffee skippers do <laughs> whatever get out of here you're free <laughs> well yeah we all know that that uh, that happened once or twice I know Val knows what well, I hope. I joke around for fun and not malice and detect the same stuff around other people. Yeah, exactly. Like, I feel like I know when it's banter. If it's not, then we cool it off. Final Fantasy XIV community is aggressively non-toxic to the point of being toxic. Toxic positivity is a thing as well. <laughs> like, murlocs and quaggins can be friends. <gasps> exactly. Just like how my nails and Caesar are absolute best friends, by the way. Best friends forever. Nothing wrong with copying. Guild Wars 2 has copied Final Fantasy's trials for endgame content now. Obviously, the WoW does know what I'm about to learn from. Yeah, I think it's good that they do that. I mean, obviously, you shouldn't be like blatantly maybe copy copying. But take something good, put it into your game with a, with a small spin. Because that's also how we make the games we love better right i think it's good that wow uh that that wow had a bad spree it meant blizzard had to shape up now that they're not like the only you know they're not the only mmo out there they're not the only option and they're having to find stuff that people like in other games and implement them in in wow to make it better and more fun for us and that goes with any game you need competition to improve and get better guild wars should learn how to make realistic courses yes can we talk about this for a second because i just need to talk about this for a second seriously i love horses okay i can't spell i can absolutely not spell i love horses and I love a Pegasus just as much as any old gal, you know, or unicorns and all that stuff. But I look at this and I, it's so cute and I really want it. But it also looks really, really weird. And I know that it's a little bit of a, a hippogriff or whatever because it's got the, 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 the talons and whatnot. But there's something really wrong with the proportions here anyway. I just don't know what's going on with this thing. <laughs> I know it's a Pegasus Griffin, but there is something. There is something. That just look. Do you guys not think something looks off with it? I would like to be able to see it without its wings. But I just... I don't know. There, there's something going on like with the neck. Like here? Like, it's too... Like, it looks... This looks more like a wolf. Like, a wolf's profile here. I don't know why I'm pointing with my finger, but... Uh... You know, like, no, I'm not even accounting for the stubby legs. Like, the, 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 the stubby legs are kind of cute. I kind of like the legs. They're, they're, they're cute. They're cute and stubby, but... I don't know. It's because horses don't exist in Guild Wars 2. I know. You know, I didn't even realize I hadn't seen a single horse in this game until someone, like, mentioned it a while ago. Like, yeah, there are no horses. There's centaurs, which look fine. But apparently, we can't do horses. <laughs> I guess it's because they had to fit in the griffin skeleton. Yeah, I I mean, maybe. Prob probably, yes. But you can definitely see... 
you can definitely see the like this curvature okay that was like the worst skin because of all the special effects but the the really like low profile curvature like this is what they gave the horse as well and i think that's what makes it looks really weird these guys on the other hand are absolutely fabulous and i want my griffin to look like this i cannot wait to get a griffin so i can get such a cute and little cuddly thing <laughs> <laughs> so adorable. The Pegasus, no, reckless. <laughs> we need a Pegasus emote. It's the Pega. <laughs> Did I see the Halloween cat griffin? No. Where can I see it? Did I? Maybe. Wait, I can. Why do I keep on going into the shop? I can see every single mount skin here, right? What's it called? Uh, Halloween Cat Griffin? Well, it's not. The f this Molten Phoenix? Holy shit. That was awesome. Oh, this one! Yes! Yes, I saw this one. It's so cute. I was like, I'm not going to get anything because I don't even have the mounts yet. Like, I need to, I need to work at getting the mounts first and then we can discuss. The curvature is high, too high for a tiger, but you won't mention that right. No, 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 no. It's a perfect curvature. What are you talking about? It's amazing. Look at... To be fair, you know... It's it's perfect. It's so cute. Look at him. He's regal. He's a regal boy. And this one... Look at you, Thai. Look at you. Okay, I don't know. Maybe there's one that looks more like you, but that this almost looks like Caesar. This is Caesar, and this is Lumi. No, the, there's the other ones. There, There is one that looks like Lumi. Isn't there one that just looks like a snow? Oh, it is so cute. Isn't there one that just looks like a leopard? Oh my god, this one's amazing. <laughs> Yo, Steven! Uh, hello! Happy weekend, how are you? Oh, thank you so much for gifting us up to the community. I'm out of cute stickies. I'm out of cute stickies. So uh, you're going to be special on the square sticky today. They're working. Wait, you don't usually work on the weekend, Steven. These are don't try to trick me, woman. I smell food. <laughs> thank you so much for the gifted sub. I hope work is over swiftly. For sure. Okay, maybe that was the Lumi one, because that's the only those are the only kitty one. Oh my god, this is Lumi. I think those are the this yeah, this is this is definitely Lulu. This is my cat. This is my other cat. And this is oh my god, this is such a, It's just like look at the cheeks. Oh my god. No, look at the cheeks on this one. You see how it's moving? He's like a real chunk. Oh my god. The other ones don't have cheeks moving like that because the way the fur is, it's different. You see that? Oh, that's really cool. But this one... Oh my god, the chunk! <laughs> I'm absolutely freaking out right now. <laughs> Look at the chunk. This is the best boy. Chunkiri. <laughs> this is the best boy. <laughs> Eight hours, double pay. I'm glad you're getting double pay for that. There is a this very square postie. Thanks for coming in to say hi. I hope work is over soon. Enjoy the double pay and I will see you later, Steven. We're cat gonna have heart problems. No, 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 because look, he's very musk. Oh, wait, he's, oh, wow. He's chunky all, he's chunky all over. I didn't even realize. Oh my god, he is. Okay, now I just feel sorry for him. He actually chunky all over. What a chunker. Niels, what's up? Okay, I don't care. I would love him anyway. Look, even the tail is chunky. Oh my god, he's so cute. I just need to grab a chunker now. Oh, you, you're so cute. I had to grab Caesar's cheeks. They're not as chunky, but they're good. 
yes. All of okay. Um not that one. Okay, that's really cool. All the galactic griffin, like all those mounts are so nice. I love them. Starbound, these ones. I I think that's gonna be the the bunny skin that I unlock with my pet license mount thing. My, my mount license I have. I have a really hard time with the bunny ones. I thought I was gonna unlock that one anyway. Either that one or I don't wait, these are different obviously than the ones here. Uh I think this was beautiful as well, but then there's also the red pan. I love red pan. I love pandas. I mean a panda. He likes he likes very aggressive head pats. Very aggressive head pats. Ah. Uh, but they're I don't know, there's so many nice ones. They're so cute. And like this guy, he's so sad. He needs a friend. Beautiful. <laughs> this one is so cute. And the freaking weird ass Shiba Inu Corgi thing. They're amazing. This one. Got a striped tail, the ticker. Or the beaver. Or the. Oh, they're so cute. I mean, they're all amazing. Oh my god. I'm gonna have a really hard time picking anyway between them. But that is an issue that we will get to when I unlock them out they're gorgeous there's so many gorgeous gorgeous skins i haven't even looked at these skins in a while i'm not gonna get lost here but oh my god this is caesar i don't know what i think about this one though i can't really see where his jawline is they're all cute this i know that's it's supposed to look like a snake i don't know it looks more like a snake is this supposed to be a snake I almost kind of felt like it looked more like a snake than a, than a tiger. Either way, amazing. What skin have I not seen? Have you seen the Lithoskin? Lithoskin? Lith? Lith? Grand Lion. Also, by the way, majestic as hell. Oh, wow. I think I might have seen someone riding around on this before. Lithosol. I don't even know what that... Does that word mean something in the dictionary? Or is that a made-up name? So exciting. <laughs> Welcome back, Akuo. Ah, uh, yeah. Welcome on in. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. The Grand Lion should be an alliance only mountain wow. It's so pretty. See, so for the Griffin now, like if I had hypothetically had a Griffin mount, now I'd I'd be stuck between do I get do, do you go for cute or do you go for majestic? Cute or majestic. Um because I like majestic too. This is such a sweet, such a sweet skin. Mm. But then there's all the cute chubby wubby tigers like this guy. <laughs> different also different griffins. Yeah, that's fair. One horse combat led to half an hour of potential progress wasted. Now, honestly, uh Tanya, I was gonna I was gonna wrap up stream because uh we we ended on a pretty solid note. We finished chapter five. And so we can start with the tangled paths next stream. Thought it was uh very solid. I thought it was a, it was a it was a good spot to end. Um, I had been sitting here for quite a few hours. <gasps> Yo, Drac! That was that was really delayed. But hi, hi, <laughs> how are you? Welcome back. Good to see you. Lo lo kids. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. Da, 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 da. <gasps> Mermius Bobby! I just wrapped up the last giveaway of today. But uh 
it won't be my last one for sure yes uh reckless i've already been drooling over the starborn outfit today because <laughs> i was like oh my god i need this when it comes back on rotation i'm buying it it is so amazing now we got stuck looking at mounts or we i i i got stuck i'm doing good drag i've progressed a bit in my guild wars 2 story and uh been giving my cat scritches all day it feels like yeah these bags are atrocious i know i know i feel like i try to do i try to do maintenance regularly on my bags like every time i finish a set of quests or like a storyline and i get loot boxes and then the loot boxes have loot boxes <laughs> um but I, I try i try i try to maintain a clean bag but i know i also have a lot of junk that i could get rid of actually i can get rid of the invitation to the super adventure festival now right because that's done and over with and it's there and i only need two more to like get my combined amulet that's one more uh one more thing free i don't know if i should be saving I should probably save the baubles and stuff for next year, right? Hey, what are you doing? I need to- well, I need this bigger bank. <laughs> I need more bank tabs. That's my problem. Hmm. I can't delete stuff in my bags. Hashtag hoarder, so this looks fine. I'm- I'm glad that someone else understands me. Because what if you, what if you delete it, and then at some point down the road, you're like, darn, I really could have used that insert random item here thing at this moment, but ah, I threw it out <laughs> two weeks ago because I thought it was useless. <laughs> oh. Uh, what time do you usually stream? So my regular streaming schedule is Mondays, Wednesdays, and Sundays. Um, and I'm in Sweden. So Central European time. From about like 6-ish p.m. Till, uh, I don't know, like 9 or 10 p.m. Depending on how I'm feeling. Uh, I usually do like three or four hour streams. Uh, on Mondays and Wednesdays, yeah, so like six Mondays and Wednesdays, and then on Sundays, I tend to do much longer streams, starting around lunchtime. I think I was on, was on like half past twelve today or something ish, maybe closer to one, <laughs> but yeah. Um, next weekend there might be some changes though. I have uh i have the place to myself on saturday i will be streaming on saturday um i will be streaming yeah i'll be streaming on saturday which means i'll probably be doing a shorter sunday stream but i should be streaming both days next weekend oh more streams uh when you is eastern time so I might be able to pop in during lunch if I can. It will be lovely to see you again whenever you can. Um, otherwise, well, I guess I can catch you on the weekends when I do my longer streams. Do they live with my parents? No. Much to my mother's dismay, I moved out about four and a half years ago-ish. Um, that was weird. It's just been like mum and me for very very long it was time to leave the nest so to speak i still see her every single week for dinner or just chit chat or whatnot she's got her herself a pair of kitties as well she went and bought two bengal cats <laughs> i my whole childhood i grew up morning cats i was like i want cats i want cats i want cats and mom was just like nah too much responsibility like we can't travel it's too much of a hassle <laughs> and then as soon as i moved out she was like well okay let's kind of 
lonely in the house now. Like, I, I get it. And she bought cats. And I'm just like, what? I'm glad she did buy cats. She got two really, really good cats. They have great personalities. Personalities, pun intended. Um, they're super sweet. Bengals as well. But yeah. I feel like that happens a lot. That happened to like a lot of my friends as well. They always wanted like a dog or a cat growing up. But then when they like move out, that's when their parents are like, okay, well, I guess it's time to get a dog. <laughs> but, oh well. Nothing wrong with that. But yes, um, so I'm going to go and make myself some dinners and enjoy the rest of my evening in the couch. It's been a blast hanging out today. I don't want to close the, <laughs> I don't want to close the shop because they're so cute. They're so cute. Um, but I'm going to find someone else super lovely for you guys to go see. Um, yeah, I will be back again tomorrow. Uh, when I'm home, as soon as I'm home from work, which is, like I said, is around, is around six o'clock in the evening, uh, European time. If you guys enjoyed the stream, don't forget to follow if you want to catch me live again. Otherwise, we have a Discord, which I promise is <laughs> very cringe-free and super wholesome. Uh... Nah, but for real, the I love our Discord. I check it all the time, and I'm always like so warm and fuzzy inside when I see that people are chatting with each other, even when I'm not there. I get really sad if I go into Discord and there are no new, no new notifications in the channel, but that like rarely happens anymore. I don't know. I just like reading. It's such a nice pastime, especially when I'm at work. Like tap into Discord. Like, oh, what's going on in here? Um short stream for me i know i'm sorry drag it's been a long one for me i have been sitting here for what like six hours or something the stream got a bit botched in the beginning but it's been a good one yeah i will uh i'll see you guys in discord tomorrow and then see you for another stream as well in the evening all right who's Who's, 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 who, I was going to say, who's awake? Who's awake at this time? What do we want to see? If I bally. <laughs> yes. I, um. I do appreciate you guys hanging out. You've been awesome as always. Awesome as always. Thanks for hanging. Joey, you want to see Joey? All right. Let's go see Joey. I'm super hungry. We'll, uh, we'll find someone new to raid next time. I just felt like I wanted to make a sweet escape. <laughs> Doofus, thank you so much for the follow. Have a lovely uh, rest of your weekend. Sorry, did it. I almost raided myself. Silly Val. Silly. <gasps> Rudy? I have to check them out next time. I will. Thank you for the tip. Are they live now? I'm going to check them out now while I eat some dinners. All right. Uh, yeah. Um. Thanks for hanging out with, through the, through the Guild Wars story. Um... I look forward to be able to be playing and doing some content with you guys as well in the future. Maybe if I feel like I need to take a break from the story for a little bit, you guys can teach me how to do like meta trains or something. <laughs> It'd be fun to do some uh, community content. If you raid yourself before raiding someone else, is it then a raid train? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'll get like an error if I try to raid myself. I have never actually attempted to before. <laughs> Oh, we'll see. <laughs> Thank you guys for hanging out. Message? Just go spam the boobs. But, I mean... You guys... Can go and say whatever you things. Oh my god, you scared the heck out of me! Oh my god, you're not anonymous anymore. 
Eggs. It's a pleasure as always. Thank you so much for the ooh. Makes my day. I hope you're well. And uh, yes, I will see you guys tomorrow evening. Go be nice to Joey. Bye.